Oh, hi. Hello. Hello, 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 hello. We are here with Mass Effect Legendary Edition, Mass Effect 1. Everyone clap. Very cool. Um, so I have played through Mass Effect 1 in the past on stream. I, <clears throat> I did a playthrough and I think we even started Mass Effect 2. This was a while ago. I think before I started Persona. If I remember, I don't remember, but I'm pretty sure it was. What else was on the wheel? It's a secret. No ultra kill. Ultra kill costs money. Money I do not have. But we have played Mass Effect 1 before, but that was on PC. I played on Steam and now I'm playing on my Xbox for obvious reasons. I didn't feel like making the space for Mass Effect Legendary Edition on my PC because it's rather large you can't at least on xbox you can download the games in like separately but on pc it's just like okay i hope you have fucking 100 and something gigabytes just sitting there chilling and i don't so here we are so we're starting fresh starting clean so fresh and so clean um granted we are still i still want to do full renegade full bad boy full full piece of shit playthrough because i've never done one i want to do all the games as bad bad man so we're going to do all the games as bad bad man i chose this i chose mass effect uh as well to put on the uh the wheel because mass effects uh the first game's pretty short and we have like what two weeks until gaiden so I will definitely beat Mass Effect 1 before Gaiden. That's not even a question. I think the last the last time I played it, it only took five streams. And now I was streaming shorter periods of time then, I'm pretty sure, than I stream recently. So it only took like five streams last time. That's why I put it on the list. I only put games that were like relatively short or just like weren't like story based like overwatch on the list to uh because i don't want to get into anything i don't want to get into anything um long before gaiden is gaiden's obviously like the next game that i'm going to be sinking my teeth in for a good amount of time so we're just gonna you know and we're gonna find them some shorter games to play until then because we beat cyberpunk which was i'm still i will be lying if i said i didn't play cyberpunk a lot of the weekend but i was kind of busy like yesterday i spent let me start on my fucking customization strikers is short yeah okay. <laughs> I, I i fucking know i went to how how long to beat it's short come for a persona game that much is certain strikers i already have strikers was free on playstation only like 60 hours strikers that i already have on playstation for free that's the only reason why it's ever in the rotation it's like you can't afford that right now buy ultra kill and beat it twice i would love to buy ultra kill if i had money um let's see i can't even justify buying a supply pass in fucking star rail right now that is where I am financially. That's five dollars. So. Too many fucking games came out this fucking at the end of the year. A lot of shit happened. A lot of shit. A lot of video games. Please log in to access your profile. Shut the fuck up, lady. Um. Let's see what's a good name. Hmm. 
Ooh, lots of wins. No. Also, there's one thing changed from base game in 2.0. Apparently, they buffed the Smasher for it, as they should. Winston Shepard. That is the name of somebody who fucking is a piece of shit right there. No, I wanted to change more. Warning. Or do Data I? Can I? Detected. Please reconstruct profile. Can I change more? Confirm pre-service history. Please go back. log in to access your profile. Okay, create custom. Please log in to access your profile. Okay, so maybe I will be able to. Maybe I'm just being stupid. Yeah, no, my, my, I said in uh, corruption detected. the Discord. Reconstruct profile. Um, fucking Confirm pre Netrunner. History. Yikers. <laughs> this is kind of diffy seal. Uh, Spacer, Earthborn. I'm like 20 hours into <laughs> Cyberpunk, I think. And I don't do the main story at all. I'm on Street Card 40, I think. Last main story thing I did is talk to the Japanese man at the restaurant. Yeah, no, that's how I played when I first started. <clears throat> that is what I do in every playthrough. I just do gigs. I do gigs. I get my street cred to 50 and get as high as I can. And then when I run out of gigs, I do gigs for money. So then I have money to just be at like a decent uh, spot, like do gigs for money and then sell any weapons that you have really that you don't want to use because like breaking down weapons like you only really upgrade weapons once they're like tier 5 then you could go to tier 5 plus and tier 5 plus plus so breaking down weapons you don't really need to do until like you already have like the weapons you want to use for the rest of the game you want to upgrade them so I just sell everything. Like I had a million eddies on my Corpo playthrough before I even went to go see Judy after the heist. Uh, okay. Uh, space or both of your parents were in the Alliance military. Child Hill just spent on ships and stations as they transferred. No, that doesn't seem like an asshole. You were born and raised on Mind M Yeah, word. A small border colony, uh, colony in the Attican Traverse when you were 16. Slavers raided Mender, slaughtering your family. That is like brutal. You were an orphan. All these are like, you were an orphan raised on the streets. Can't be an asshole if you're an orphan. I feel like that just doesn't make sense. <laughs> you escaped the life of petty crime and underground gigs by enlisting in the military, you know. Uh, never staying in one location for long. Following your parents' footsteps, you enlisted. Hmm. We'll go spacer. Colonists are assholes. Yeah, but this specific colonist had his like whole family murdered. I feel like I don't know if this this guy specifically would be an asshole. But maybe he's an asshole because everything he taught and loves died. We can go with that, to be honest. Yeah. Yeah. Confirm psychological profile. Ruthless. I don't even need a fucking Confirm look at it. Military specialization. Oh, you need to look at it. Ruthless. I kind of want to go adept. I don't think I went adept before. Could go sentinel. I think I went adept with my other one when I died I went inside the entire race for hundreds of years to start <laughs> uh true you know what you make a great point to be honest vanguard uh through upgradable implants they can use biotic powers to lift the door enemies shield the squad and disable and destroy enemies or destroy, disable or destroy enemies. Adepts can only wear light armor. They specialize in pistols. I do like pistols. I don't think I've ever done just full adept, so why not? Confirm facial identification. Ah, yes. I will say 
I do not mind playing this on Xbox now because it runs a lot better than I did on my PC. Which is nice. Alright, let's look at some presets. Oh, this guy. This guy looks Australian. Like, this is like, in video games, the typical evil Australian man. You know what I'm saying? Boy, God. <laughs> it just sounds like he fucking smoke 30 packs of cigarettes a day yeah you know why you know what this is a good a good uh base a good base yeah so while i do this uh about the change of discord server i like this one oh i forgot to mute my phone <laughs> wow me six thank you only took you 20 minutes. Mm. Looks like he was sitting in a sketchy bar in a sp in sponge pop. <laughs> uh. so I need those weapons. God. Uh, speaking of the server change, I worked on uh, the new server all day yesterday, basically. So basically almost done to be honest. There's still some shit I need to test before I do. Before I open it. Go with this one. Neck thickness. Will Clyde be on the new server? That's not up to me. That's up to Discord. He's not there now though, no. Discord just plops him in there. I'm pretty sure it won't be just because it's a new server. Hydrate. Okay, it will. Year size. Give him some big ol' ears. Some big ol' fucking ears. He can hear the fucking colors of the world. water uh, all right eye shape no, i shouldn't have fucked with it i think the eyes look okay with oh it's like a little bug a little bug a little bug boy high depth can't really look at the side profile and that's like the worst thing about mass effect is like you your character look pretty cool from like the front but like you cannot see the side profile really there we go hold on we got it he's looking sideways stop 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 turning your head i don't want you to be a bug eye boy okay hey we're reading chainsaw man new chapter suck ass it's incredible how much a generic turn image becoming with every chapter i have not i haven't read fucking anything in a while i haven't heard people talking about it as nearly as much so i figured that it's probably gone down in popularity all anyone talks about on the internet now is jujutsu kaisen at least on my timeline yeah give him some red eyes red eyes mean evil still slams yeah i think that's the the sad thing about just like forms of media sometimes people just knock it out the fucking park in their first fucking run the first few chapters it's so good and it's hard to keep up with that there will always be like a lull hopefully they can bring it back around though say this every fucking time i stream but i need i really do need to watch anime more i feel like i'm severely slacking all these people talk about it talk about anime that i watch and i'm like i don't know what the fuck that is 
Give him some nice lips. So people could see when he's telling them they eat a dick. Not the anime. I count on it because he went to his head. He doesn't want to draw the damn manga anymore. He just wants to write the story, which is basically non existent. That's a shame. I wonder why. I guess maybe he didn't want it to be as popular as it was. Maybe he feels pressure in fucking doing it now. Give him a big ol' honker. I don't like the big ol' honker on him. Got a big ol' honking nose. Everyone that I've met that has a really big nose has kind of been rude to me, so. Damn, why can't I make this, like, the nice full beard? Maybe it's very true, you know? Yeah, maybe he just felt the pressure from it, uh... Getting so popular. So now he's like trying to make it very generic when the reason it got popular in and of itself is just because we just keep the mohawk. Yeah, why not? Uh, the reason it got so popular is because it was not generic, you know? Oh, that looks better. I have a big message. I'm just speaking on my experience in the world. I'm not saying that everyone does, but the people I've met, my lifetime, I've been. I've had some pretty large monitors that have been mean to me. And we'll go with this. This is this is Winston fucking Shepard. He stops drawing. I'm gonna stop reading. The art is the only thing keeping me reading right now. Fair. Yeah, at that point, it's like, it won't even feel like the same at that. Winston Falcon, 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 Shepard. Look at this, man. Yeah, this is an asshole if I've ever seen it. Complete. <laughs> this is an asshole if I've ever seen it. All right. Once you confirm character, you will be on my new okay. Identification confirmed. Normal, legendary mode, level scaling. I don't know what's the difference, so we'll go with that. Auto level up, no. Subtitles on defensive, okay. And auto save. Alright. Here we go. Well, what about Shepard? He grew up in the colonies. He knows how to What about me? Mike. His parents were killed when slavers attacked Mindwa. Born on the Outback. He got most of his unit killed on Torfin. He gets the job done, no matter what the cost. Is that the kind of person we want protecting the galaxy? That's the only kind of person who can protect the galaxy. Yeah, fucking I'll asshole. I'll make the call. In the year 2148, explorers from Mars discovered the remains of an ancient spacefaring civilization in the decades that followed. The, these mysterious artifacts revealed uh, startling new technologies enabling travel to the first further stars. Uh, the basis of for this incredible technology was a force that controlled the very fabric of space and time. They called it the greatest discovery in human history. Oof. I couldn't read it all, but I tried. I did my best. Arcturus Prime relays in range, initiating transmission sequence. Commander. Commander. I love space. We are connected. Calculating transit mass and destination. The relay is hot. Acquiring approach vector. All stations secure for transit. Approach run has begun. 
Oh, Topaz? Question mark? Thrusters, check. Navigation, check. Internal emissions sync engaged. All systems online. Drift, just under 1500k. 1500 is good. Your captain will be pleased. Your captain will be pleased. I hate that guy. Nihilus gave you a compliment. So you hate Shut him. Shut the fuck up, Caden. Look at your hair. Remember to zip up your jumpsuit on the way out of the bathroom? That's good. I just jumped us halfway across the galaxy and hit a target the size of a pinhead. So that's incredible. Besides, specters are trouble. I don't like having them on board. Call me paranoid. You're paranoid. The Council helped fund this project. They have a right to send someone to keep an eye on their investment. Yeah, that is the official story. But only an idiot believes the official Cut story. Cut the chatter. Shut that's the enough. fuck up. Your soldiers. Act yeah. Like it. Yeah. Sorry, Commander. Yeah, shut the Joker. fuck up. Don't talk in my spoken to you. Just cleared the mass relay, Captain. Stealth systems engaged. Everything looks solid. Good. Find a comm buoy and link us into the network. I want mission reports relayed back to Alliance Brass before we reach each other. got a big ass head. Aye, aye, Captain. Better brace yourself, sir. I think Nihilus is headed your way. He's already here, Lieutenant. Tell Commander Shepard to meet me in the calm room for a debriefing. You get that, Commander? You made him mad. Great. You pissed the captain off, and now I'm going to pay for it. <laughs> Don't blame me. The captain's always I'll mad. See you later, I mean, you to you, fight. Me fight you, Peter, on your bed. I hope not, dude. <laughs> Thank you for hanging out. Over. Have a good rest of your day. All right. Press the start button to access something. I wasn't paying attention. Okay, speak to the captain. All right, so let us increase damage reduction by five percent. Increase hardening by five percent. <laughs> he said hard. Um, charm. Intimidate? Put our intimidate up. Actually, we should probably put a barrier up, but you know what? It's fine. We'll be okay. We'll be okay. Smile. Uh, in West Philadelphia, born and raised on the playground, is where I spent most of my days. Feeling more lacking. It's nice to play this at a consistent frame rate. Cause this is not my computer did not like playing this game while streaming anyway. Commander Shepard, I was hoping you'd get here first. It will give us a chance to talk. Where's Anderson? The captain said he'd meet me here. He's on his way. The captain said he'd meet me here. I'm interested in this world we're going to. Eden Prime. I've heard it's quite beautiful. So what? I'm a marine, not some tourist on vacation. Yeah, it's home. more than just a tourist destination, isn't it, Shepard? Eden Prime is a symbol of your people. A perfect little world on the edges of your territory. Proof that humanity can not only establish colonies across the galaxy, but also protect them. But how safe is it, really? Is that a threat, a little you alien man? Me, Spectre? Your people are still newcomers, Shepard. The galaxy can be a very dangerous place. Is the Alliance truly ready for Give this? Give me your armor. I think it's about time we told the commander what's really going on. This mission is far more than a simple shakedown run. I already figured that out. We're making a covert pickup on Eden Prime. I love being an asshole well, in this game. The it's so funny. Operational. Um, why the secrecy? You should have told me. What are we picking up? You should have told me. I don't me. like being kept in the dark, Captain. Yeah, I don't. This comes down from the top, Commander. Information strictly on a need-to-know basis. And I need to know. Research team on this is my ship. Unearth some kind of. Well, it's not yet, but it will be. It was Prothean. Prothean. I thought the Protheans vanished fifty thousand years ago. Their legacy still remains. Shepard, you should get some chapstick, dog. Citadel, our ship drives. It's all based on Prothean technology. This is big, Shepard. The last time humanity made a discovery like this, it jumped our technology forward two hundred years. 
But Eden Prime doesn't have the facilities to handle something like this. We need to bring the beacon back to the Citadel for private Anderson, safety. open your mouth to talk. Obviously, this could open your mouth more. Human interests, Commander. This discovery could affect every species in Council space. Oh, uh, why did we tell the Council? We don't need your help. We can handle this on our own. Unless something goes wrong. There's more, Shepard. Nihilus isn't just here for the beacon. He's also here to evaluate you. Like hell he is. Since when do we answer to the Spectres? You're smart enough to know how things work, Commander. The Alliance has been pushing for this for a long time. Humanity wants a larger role in shaping interstellar policy. We want more say with the Citadel Council. The Spectres represent the Council's power and authority. If they accept a human into their ranks, it shows how far the Alliance has come. I was impressed when I studied the reports from Torfin. A grim business, but you got the job done. That's yeah, why I always I get the job done. Forward as a candidate for the Spectres. You put my name forward? Why would a Turian want a human in the Spectres? Not all Turians resent humanity. <coughs> Some of us see the potential of your species. We see what you have to offer to the rest of the galaxy and to the Spectres. We are an elite group. It's rare to I can't wait for the new Mass Effect skills. game that got announced like 17 years ago Shepherd. that still I have not heard can, anything about. Can do the job. I don't think I say it enough, but I really like Mass Effect. What if I, I don't refuse? Like people making decisions about my future. This isn't about you, Shepard. Humanity needs this. We're counting on you. Oh, but it is about me. Skills for myself, Commander. Eden Prime will be the oh, first about me. Together. You'll be in charge of the ground team. Secure the beacon and get it onto the ship ASAP. Nihilus will accompany you to observe the mission. Investigate. Uh, Prothean. Okay, we already spoke about most of this. I think the beacon. Why is this beacon so important? All advanced galactic civilization is based on Prothean technology, even yours. If we hadn't discovered those Prothean ruins buried on Mars, we'd still be stuck on Earth. That was just a small data cache. Who knows what we can learn from this beacon? What if it's a weapons archive? We can't let it fall into the wrong hands. Like who? The Attican Traverse isn't the most stable sector of Citadel space. There are plenty of raiders and criminal groups active in the region. They mm. might figure a Prothean beacon is worth the risk of attacking an Alliance ship. Plus, Eden Prime is right on the border of the Terminus systems. The Terminus systems? The Attican Traverse is under Citadel protection. If the Terminus systems attack, it's an act of war. Technically, yes. But some of the species in the Terminus might be willing to start a war over this. The last thing the Council wants is to get Interesting. into a major conflict with the Terminus systems. Yes. We have to keep this low key. I'm ready to Just go. give the word, Captain. We should be getting close to Eden. Captain, we got a problem. Oh, What's wrong, it. Joker? Transmission from Eden Scared Prime, the shit out of me, Joker. Looking Bring cool, Joker. Screen. It's the racist. We are under attack, taking heavy casualties. I repeat, heavy casualties. We can't get evac. They came out of nowhere. We need. Damn, we got fucked up, homie. Oh my god, it's a fucking Cthulhu monster. The Reaper. It's a Reaper. It cuts out after that. No calm traffic at all. It just goes dead. There's nothing. Reverse and hold at 38.5. Status report. 17 minutes out, Captain. No other Alliance ships in the area. Take us in, Joker. Fast and quiet. This mission just got a lot more complicated. A small strike team can move quickly without drawing attention. It's our best chance to secure the beacon. Grab your gear and meet us in the Come. cargo hold. Oi. Tell Elenko and Jenkins to suit up, Commander. You're going in. Sounds good. Engaging now go stealth find systems. The Cthulhu. Somebody was doing some serious digging here, Captain. 
Your team's the muscle in this operation, Commander. Go in heavy and head straight for the dig site. What about survivors, Captain? Helping survivors is a secondary objective. The beacon's your top priority. Approaching drop point one. Yeah, fuck survivors. You coming with us? I move faster on my own. You look like you move pretty ahead. slow. He'll feed you status reports throughout the mission. Otherwise, I want radio silence. Can we trust? I don't like putting my life in the hands of a Turian, sir. Nihilus is on our side. He wants you in the Spectres, and he wants that beacon. Ready and able, sir. The mission's yours now. Shepard. I hate when they kind of just make me fucking hate alien races as a whole. Like I hate everyone. Approaching drop point two. You know what I'm saying? But like, Winston hates everyone. I don't think he's racist. He just hates everyone. But like this game's fucking uh idea of being an asshole is just being real racist to all the other alien race. What the hell are those? I just might to draw the weapon that button. I don't care if they're harmless. They're ugly. I don't want to look at them. I just threw a grenade, didn't I? What happened here? Hold LB to switch the weapons for your squad. Okay. Uh, you, yeah, you guys use whatever the fuck you use. I'm gonna switch back to my pistol now. If you don't. Mind. Oh, never mind. Ah, Jenkins, no. Fucking hitting the bill cams, brother. Let me fucking hit him with a quick 360. All right, the quickest 360 you ever done seen. Jenkins. Rip right through his shields. You're at a chance. Forget about him. Leave him. We need to finish the mission. Aye, aye, sir. Renegade plus two, baby. <laughs> I'm a big old baddie. Two baddies, two baddies, one Porsche. Did I switch to my pistol? I guess no. I did. Okay. God damn it. I keep trying to reload. I did this so much in fuck uh, the uh, the other time I played Mass Effect. Your target regroup. Okay, get this shit off my screen. God damn it, keep throwing up! No! I keep trying to reload. I don't have to reload. God. The fucking struggle of being a, a chronic reloader. Call of Duty, you fucking bitch. You made me this way. Me why yeah. Winston Shepherd. Hey Ashley, way to show off, fucking bitch. Oh no, what are they doing to him? Oh <laughs> Ouchie. Ashley has kind of a big old snaz arena. Okay, sprint. Look at me sprint. Oh, that's Ashley. Okay. Get behind cover. Uh, how do I get? Okay, there we go. What? Fuck. Here, help, I didn't think I was gonna make it. Gunnery Chief Ashley Williams of the Two Twelve. You the one in charge here, sir? We're on a mission. I need a status report now. We were patrolling the perimeter when the attack hit. 
We tried to get off a distress call, but they cut off our communications. I've been fighting for my life ever since. What happened to your unit? Where's the rest of your squad? We tried to double back to the beacon, but we walked into an ambush. I don't think any of the others. The only thing good about Ashley is her left. fucking. Is her fucking armor. The white and the red always look nice. You abandon them. You just left bitch. the rest of your unit behind to die? We held our position as long as we could. The Geth overwhelmed us. The Geth haven't been seen outside the Vale in nearly 200 years. Why are they here now? They must have come for the beacon. The dig site is close, just over that rise. It might still be there. Well, take Coming us there. with us, Williams. We need that beacon. Aye, aye, sir. It's time for payback. Uh, okay, let's go. Move out. Come with us, bitch. Uh, press the mission computer. Oh yeah, okay, so Caden, let's see. Oh, you could put a barrier on so you don't die so fast and first aid. Maybe we should have put it in the sentinel. All right, Ashley, you fucking bitch. Uh, put, put two into a soul rifle. There you go. I have no more points. Okay. The beacon's at the far end of this trench. Nice to change your team's equipment. Okay. They don't need it. Okay, oh, we'll go look at it. I guess. Cause it'll just stay on my fucking screen if I don't. <laughs> oh, can I wear this? Nice. I already got some new armor. Poggers. Okay, let's go. Damn, this guy got fucked. Run to the waypoint and take cover behind the rock. Enter cover by moving up to a rock and then draw your weapon. Move to the edge of the cover to fire. Okay. I, I did that before. Thank you. Bang. All right. Can you get off my screen now? Okay. There we go. Bang, 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 bang. I don't need to know your name. All I want, bang, bang, bang. Oh, he dead as hell. There's more though. Where? I see some red dots. I see red dots. Stop hiding. Yeah, you like that? Oh God. Ashley, watch out. Good job. You're doing such a great job, Kaden. Shooting that rock like a fucking champion, brother. Look at him go. You guys are doing so well. You'll, you can do it. You'll pierce through that rock eventually. Look at you go. Awesome. We have great soldiers here. These men and women protect the country. Fuck you. Protect the world. Even the world's... Uh, the human race. And that is what they are doing, shooting at a fucking rock. Oh, I leveled up. All right, I wanted to put point into barrier to unlock barrier. And then... Da -da -din, da -da -din. Put that. I put another into barrier because that is going to help me. All right, since I'm using legendary edition, we get like fucking points out the wazoo. I remember now. Or was I using Kate in there? I don't remember. No, it wasn't. Okay, so it was me. I'm not stupid. All right, cool. Put fucking points into intimidate because why not? And we'll get shield boost up. Very cool. And for Kaden. Uh, since we're probably going to keep Caden, spoilers, we'll put first aid up, increase squad healing, maybe. Um, encryption. Yeah, we'll put decryption up some, why not? And actually put some into that for you. Uh, you can 
and get some of that as well. I got a little bit more health. There you go, baby girl. Okay, let's investigate the dig site. This is the dig site. The beacon was right here. It must have been moved. By who? Our side or the Geth? Hard to say. Maybe we'll know more after we check out the research camp. Uh, we're wasting time. Let's get moving. Williams, where's the camp? It's just on the top of this ridge, up the ramps. I can't wait for the Game Awards. There's a small spaceport up ahead. I want to check it out. I'll wait for you there. Okay. I really hope we get some pretty big announcements at the Game Awards this year. Like GTA 6. Uh, Mass Effect. New Mass Effect. New Dragon Age. Like those Looks like be very nice. Hard. Those are what I'm looking for forward to. Keep your guard up. Another game that was on the list was Dragon's Dog. Oh god, they're still alive. I remember correctly, that game isn't very long. And I do want to play I do plan to play Dragon's Dogma 2. Okay, um let me Use barrier just in case they come close. Stop trying to reload. Hades. Okay, nice. Awesome. Okay. What's going on over here? Easy door decryption. Okay, we'll look at this. There's something over there, I think. Some locks, uh, some locked objectives require decryption or electronics access. If any squad member has the required talent to be able to unlock. Okay. Thank the maker. Oh, she has some big old Close ears. The door before they come back. I mean, what happened? How did you end up in this shed? <laughs> Man. We were here during the attack. They must have come here for the beacon. Luckily, it wasn't here. It was moved to the spaceport earlier this morning. Manuel and I stayed behind to pack up the camp. When the attack came, the Marines held them off long enough for us to hide. They gave their lives to save her us. ears like no one is saved or so the age of humanity is vertical ended. soon only ruin and corpses will remain what else can you tell me about the attack it all happened so fast Crazy. one <laughs> second we were gathering up our equipment the next we were Fucking hiding in the true. shed while the geth swarmed over the camp agents of the destroyers bringers of darkness heralds of our extinction we could hear the battle outside Gunfire. Damn, this motherfucker spoiling the, the fucking end. series, though. Then what are you doing? Went quiet. Just <laughs> what are you doing? Too afraid to move until you came along. Alright, no chances Where for me to be an asshole here. I don't care. You can't stop it. Nobody can stop it. Night is falling. The darkness of eternity. Hush, motherfucker is like Cicero. You'll feel better once the medication kicks in. <laughs> Damn. Okay. Alright. Uh, don't die, I guess. Space. Ooh, sniper rifle and heavy human armor. Do you use heavy armor, Ashley? I know you don't. What about, do you, bitch? No, she uses medium. Okay. Schmedium, you wear schmedium. Okay, so. Alright, you guys don't need new stuff. I do, because I'm the protagonist. I'm going to take this Reaper sniper rifle and the shotgun and uh, do I have another assault rifle? I would give that to Ashley. No, I don't. Okay. Let's make a save. Cool. All right. I'm let those go. No. Nihilus. Who's that? It's another Turian. Wow, 
how his eyes grew so wide. He's so happy to see his senpai. Saren Chan. Midas. Saren Chan. This isn't your mission, Saren. What are you doing here? The council thought you could use some help on this one. I wasn't expecting to find the Geth here. The situation's bad. Don't worry. I've got it under control. Oh. Oh no. No! Nihilus! You can never trust your senpai. What is that? Off in the distance. What is that? Look at the oh. oh, look at that thing. Alright, just don't mind me, I was getting a s I was good. I was getting a thumbnail. <laughs> Uh, just being a, just being a content creator. Okay. Thank you for waiting husks. I appreciate you uh, Put a barrier on Come here, I don't even know your name all I want Bing, bing, bing. Fine you guys got it. Yeah, look at you go. Look at you go. Good job guys Nice Awesome. I keep trying to reload. Good thing I have no grenades. I keep catching myself trying to reload. I hacker man's over here. Ah, I'm on fire. I can hacker man's. Got some Omni gel. Doing pretty well. Don't need it. Okay. Begin the manual override. A B X X. Oof, hard. Everybody, stay calm out there. We're coming out. We're not armed. Is it safe? Are they gone? Stop right Nobody there. Nobody moves a muscle until we know who you are. Don't fucking resist. Nice going, Cole. I told you we should have stayed hidden. It's okay. We're all on the same side here. We're just farmers. We've been hiding ever since that ship first showed up. We are farmers. Bum, Tell me everything bum, you remember bum, bum. about the attack. The three of us were working the crops when that ship showed up. We just mm -hmm. saw it and ran. Likely so. I don't know what happened to the rest of the crew. Mm -hmm. They were by the garage, over near the spaceport, right where that ship came down. No way they survived. You don't know that. We survived. If they made it to the garage, they could have had a fighting chance. Mm, sure, I don't know. Do you know anything about the Prothean beacon they dug up? We're just farmers. We heard they found something out there, but it never really mattered to us. Finger line. Now. What else can you tell me about the ship you saw? I think you're a little liar pants. Busy running to get a clear look at it. I think it landed over near the spaceport. Tell them about the noise, Cole. That awful noise. It was emitting some kind of signal as it descended. It sounded like the shriek of the damned. Only it was coming from inside your own head. It was probably trying to block communications. Whatever it was, it felt like it was tearing right through my skull. Almost made it impossible to think. I have to go. Hey, Cole, we're just a bunch of farmers. These guys are soldiers. Maybe we should give them the stuff. Jeez, Blake, you gotta learn when to shut up. I don't like if being lied to. You're not telling me. Some guys at the spaceport were running a small smuggling ring. Nothing major. In exchange for a cut of the profits, we let them store packages in our sheds. You greedy bastard. You weren't running <laughs> for your life. You were running to check on your merchandise. No, it's not like that. I just. I just knew there were some packages here. Something greedy fuck. I found a pistol. Shoot him, Shepard. It would come in handy if those things came back. No, give me it. You'll probably get more use out of it than we will. You're holding out on me. I'm gonna ask this once. Think long and hard before you lie to me again. Are you sure all you've got is one lousy pistol? Uh, no, no wait. I just remembered. <laughs> I, I just had it in my pocket. Yeah. Might as well take that too. Yeah, but yeah, I should. Who's your contact at the spaceport, Cole? What's his name? He's not a bad guy. I don't want to get him in trouble. Is Besides, he worth I'm dying for? Would you rather be a snitch or a corpse? Powell. His name's Powell. No honor among thieves. That's all I know, really. So let's try to keep <laughs> things friendly from here on in, okay? I have to go. Good luck. <laughs> Good luck. Oh, so he gives me a pistol and a weapon upgrade. Wow, very cool. See what happens when you're you just fucking cooperate, dog. Good job, proud of you. 
18 personnel rounds. We'll put chemical rounds in that. Why not? Hell yeah. Awesome. We got a nice little pistol now. Look at us. We're already fucking upgrading. Fucking great. Fucking awesome. Commander, it's Nihilus. Wow, no, Nihilus. Damn, who did this to you, Nihilus? <laughs> who did this to you? No, Nihilus, no. As I check loot, no. Nihilus, no. Something's moving over behind those crates. Wait, don't, don't shoot. I'm one of you. I'm human. I like the way you hid behind those crates during the fight. Really helped us out. Thanks a lot. Me? But, but I'm just a dock worker. I don't even have a weapon. My name's Powell. I saw what happened to that Turian. The other one shot him. What the hell are you talking about? There were two Turians here. Your friend and another one he called Saren. I think they knew each other. Your friend seemed to relax. He let a witness. And Saren killed him. Shot him right in the back. Just lucky he didn't see me behind the crates. And then what? Where'd Saren go after he killed Nihilus? He jumped on the cargo train and headed over to the other platform. Probably going after the beacon. I knew that beacon was trouble. Everything's gone to hell since we found it. First that damn mothership showed up, then the attack. They killed everyone. Everyone. If I hadn't been behind the crates, I'd be dead too. Ooh, Cole mentioned you. contact here on the docks for the smuggling ring. Yeah. What? No. Don't lie to me. I mean, what does it matter now? So I'm a smuggler. Who cares? My supervisor's dead. The entire crew's dead. It doesn't matter now, does it? Smuggle any Anything weapons? Hidden nearby that we could use against the Geth? A shipment of grenades came through last week. Nobody notices if a few small pieces go missing from the military orders. You greedy son of a bitch. We're out here trying to protect your sorry ass, and all you can think about is how you can rip us off? I never thought you'd actually need those grenades. Who'd want to attack Eden Prime? We're just a bunch of farmers. How was I supposed You're to pathetic. know? You're pathetic! Hand over those grenades. Now. They're yours. Take them. My smuggling days are over, I swear. You're lying! Too many people died here for you to start <laughs> jerking me around. Okay, all right. Th there was something else. Could be worth Jesus a fortune. Christ. Experimental technology, top of the line. Take it. I don't need it. I didn't want anyone to get hurt. Really, I'm sorry. Yeah. We need to find that beacon before it's too late. Take the cargo train. That's where the other Turian went. I love being a I, dick. I, I can't stay here. I need to get away from all this. Grenade upgrade. High explosive. Poggers. Oh, shit. Motherfucker scared the shit out of me, dog. Quick. We'll take out your pistol. Oh, this shit, this shit sounds beefy, dude. Bang. Oh, <laughs> get fucking disintegrated, idiot. Let's go. Bring up the power wheel. Power wheels. Yeah. Bang bang. Okay, uh Can you sabotage on him? Should be able to. I'm going to use shield boost. Motherfucker just sprinting at me. I hate the destroyers. I hate when I hate in video games when things just sprint at me. It freaks me out. Can you guys stop shooting me in the back? Yeah, this pistol slaps. Bang, bang. Or is there another Geth Trooper? Bang. Yes. All 
All right. Set the charges. Destroy the entire colony. Leave no evidence that we were here. The Prothean Beacon. Oh, he's ascending. All right, we have to disable the bombs. I remember. <laughs> Don't mind us just in our formation as we fucking ride the train. Just stood there. Disarmed. Demolition charges. The Geth must have planted them. Okay. Hurry! We have we need five to minutes. Shut them down. Yeah, 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 I know. Actually, say my first rodeo. You guys handle them. I want to say about it. Out of my way. I'm so strong. Ooh, ooh. Where's this bomb? Two charges remaining. I only see this one. There must be another one up ahead. Ooh, ah, ooh. Oh, Sugma. Uh, okay. Shield boost. Uh, hit him with the do 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 do. Oh, there's the other bomb. Protect me. Okay, we got it. Nice. How's this other gift? All, all charms disabled. All charms, all bombs. Okay, an assault rifle. Okay, we can give that to Ashley. Uh, where is she at? Ashley. Uh, okay. Does a little bit more damage per second, which will be nice. God damn it, I keep throwing grenades by accident. Shit, shit, shit. Okay, we're going to heal here. Let me put up my barrier. Use your barrier as well. Expo. Nice. So we're here. For loot. Another easy decryption. Don't mind me. X. Y. X. X. Recoil dampener. Very cool. Full star weapon. Oh, I love that camera shake. My favorite thing. Okay. Okay. Investigate the Protean Beacon. There, nothing can go wrong here. Normandy, the beacon is secure. This is amazing. Actual working Protean technology. Unbelievable. It wasn't doing anything like that when they dug it up. Something must have activated it. Roger, Normandy. Standing by. Get your stupid ass away from him. Oh, God, Ashley. No, Shepard, no! German suplex, uh... Touch. 
Ouch. We fucking broke it all because of Ashley. Good job, Ashley. Fucking idiot. Dude. Definitely not my fault. All Ashley's fault. Everyone point we and blame Ashley. The ship that touched down on Eden Prime, the Normandy, a human alliance vessel. It was under the command of Captain Anderson. Oops. They managed to save the colony and the beacon. One of the humans may have used it. This human must be eliminated. Good luck, idiot. I'm the best. Doctor, Doctor Chakwas, I think he's waking up. Shut up, Ashley. You're so loud. You had us worried there, Shepard. How are you feeling? Doing pretty fucking all right, mate. Like the morning after shore leave. How long was I out? About 15 hours. Something happened down there with the beacon, I think. It's my fault. I must have triggered some kind of security field when I approached it. You had to push me out of the way. You are careless. I expect better of my people, Williams. You endangered our entire mission. Don't be so hard on her, Commander. No, fuck her. I have her. no idea if that's what actually set it off. We do know. Unfortunately, we'll I never know. get the chance to find out. The beacon exploded. A system overload, maybe. The blast knocked you cold. The lieutenant and I carried you back here to the ship. I don't suppose it occurred to you that Eden Prime has medical facilities? Listen, you're better off in this infirmary than in any hospital on Eden Prime. Physically, you're fine. But I detected some unusual brain activity. Abnormal beta waves. I also noticed an increase in your rapid eye movement. Signs typically associated with intense dreaming. More like a nightmare. I I'm in a nightmare. I'm not sure what I saw. Death? Destruction? Nothing's really clear. Hmm. I better add this to my report. It may. Oh, Captain Anderson. How's our XO holding up, Doctor? Well, all the readings look normal. I'd say the commander's going to be fine. Glad to hear it. Shepard, I need to speak with you. In private. Aye, aye, Captain. I'll be in the mess if you need me. Sounds like that beacon hit you pretty hard, Commander. Are you sure you're okay? Feel bad about Jenkins. Why is Williams here? I'm pissed off Intel about the get. the ball, sir. We had no idea what we were walking into down there. That's why things went to hell. The Geth haven't been outside the veil in two centuries, Commander. Nobody could have predicted this. You said you needed to see me in private, Captain. I won't lie to you, Shepard. Things look bad. Nihilus is dead. The beacon was destroyed, and Geth are invading. The council's going to want answers. To hell with the them! The council can kiss my ass. I won't let them blame me for losing the beacon. I didn't do anything wrong. I'll stand behind you and your report, Shepard. You're a damned hero in my books. That's not why I'm here. It's Saren, that other Turian. Saren's a specter, one of the best, a living legend. But if he's working with the Gith, it means he's gone rogue. A rogue specter's trouble. Saren's dangerous, and he hates humans. Hates humans? Why? He thinks we're growing too fast, taking over the galaxy. A lot of aliens think that way. Most of them don't do anything about it. But Saren has allied himself with the Geth. Well, fuck him. I don't him. know how. I don't know why. I only know it had something to do with that beacon. You were there just before that beacon self-destructed. Did you see anything? Any clue that might tell us what Saren was after? Just before I lost consciousness, I had some kind of vision. A vision? A vision of what? I saw synthetics. Geth, maybe. 
slaughtering people, butchering them. We need to report this to the Council, Shepard. They'll think I'm crazy. We don't know what information was stored in that beacon. They won't think Lost I'm crazy. Because I am crazy. Weapon of mass destruction, whatever it was. Saren took it. But I know Saren. I know his reputation is politics. He believes humans are a blight on the galaxy. This attack was an act of war. He has the secrets from the beacon. He has an army of Geth at his command, and he won't stop until he's wiped humanity from the face of the galaxy. I'll find some way to take him down. It's not that easy. He's a specter. He can go anywhere, do almost anything. That's why we need the council on our side. They can't when help have us. They ever done anything for humanity. Yeah. If we expose Saren, they Spectre, think we smell. The council will revoke his specter status. I'll contact the ambassador and see if he can get us an audience with the council. He'll okay. want to see us as soon as we reach the Citadel. We should be getting close. Head up to the bridge and tell Joe to bring us into dock. Are you It looks like it. <clears throat> Art. <laughs> What do you want? After what happened to Jenkins, the crew could use some good news. They'll be glad to hear you're okay. Are you on the Normandy? You're not assigned to this ship. Captain Anderson had me transferred to his command. Must have figured I knew what I was doing. You have a problem with me, Chief? Yeah, you bitch. You questioned my competence through the entire mission. Best way to stop that is to show me you're competent. Exactly. But I don't remember inviting you to come back to the ship with us. Bitch. You didn't. Captain Anderson did. She didn't say sir. That fucker that that line the, the, the subtitle I lied to me. Speak with Joker. Goodbye, Commander. Fuck you, Ashley. Fuck you. Fuck you. And you, Caden. Glad to see you're okay, uh, Commander. I, I, I guess I gonna bitch him out. Alright, Anderson. We have to talk to Joker, right? Alright, let's go talk to Joker. Not over here, or is it up? It might. Uh, it's probably upstairs. Yeah, upstairs. Ew. Ew. Can I just take that elevator or the stairs? Uh huh. Navigator Presley. Doing your fucking work, huh? I'm glad you're okay, Commander. Losing Jenkins was hard enough on the crew. Yeah, well, Jenkins is kind of stupid, to be honest. Kind of brought that shit upon himself on God. Good timing, Commander. I was just about to bring us into the Citadel. See that taxpayer money at work. Oh god. Fucking EP. So don't know so cool. Look at the size of that ship. The Ascension. Flagship of the Citadel fleet. Well, size isn't everything. Why so touchy, Joker? I'm just saying you need firepower, too. Look at that monster. Its main gun could rip through the barriers in any ship in the Alliance fleet. Good thing it's on our side, then. Citadel Control, this is SSV Normandy, requesting permission to land. Stand by for clearance, Normandy. Clearance granted. You may begin your approach. Transferring you to an Alliance operator. Roger, Alliance Tower. Normandy out. No, oh, the Metal Gear Solid, Solid collection came out today. Or tomorrow? Or tomorrow? Wow! I love space. Hey, 
This is an outrage. The oh, council would step in if the Geth attacked a Turian colony. The Turians don't found colonies on the borders of the Terminus systems, Ambassador. Humanity was well aware of the risks when you went into the Traverse. What about Seren? You can't just ignore a rogue specter. I demand action. You don't get to make demands of a council, Ambassador. Citadel Security is investigating your charges against Seren. We will discuss the CSEC findings at the hearing, not before. Captain Anderson, I see you brought half your crew with you. Just the ground team from Eden Prime, in case you had any questions. I have the mission reports. I assume they're accurate. Udina, shut the fuck they up are. and get some fucking chapstick, homie. Sounds like you convinced the council to give us an audience. I fucking hate Udina. They were not happy about it. Seren's their top agent. They don't like him being accused of treason. They're blind. I'm not going to sit on my ass just because the council doesn't want to do anything. If they won't stop Saren, I will. Settle down, Commander. You've already done more than enough to jeopardize your candidacy for the Spectres. The mission on Eden Prime was a chance to prove you could get the job done. Instead, Nihilus ended up dead and the beacon was destroyed. That's Saren's fault, not his. Then we better hope the CSEC investigation turns up evidence to support our accusations. Otherwise, the Council might use this as an excuse to keep you out of the Spectres. Come with me, Captain. I want to go over a few things before the hearing. Shepard, you and the others can meet us at the Citadel Tower, top level. I'll make sure you have clearance to get in. And that's why I hate politicians. Amen, sister. Important locations are marked on your map. Open the mission computer. <laughs> Uh, did we level? I did the encryption. Y. X. B. X. Wow. Lore. It's over here. This is serious. My reputation is at stake. I spoke with the consul. These guys look so cool. And, her alone, and she betrayed that confidence. All right. Earth Clan, you are in the wrong place, I think. Your ambassador is next door in the large office. Chastising remark. Don't be so rude, Dan. At least introduce yourself. Yeah, don't be so fucking rude, Din. I am Din Korlak, Volus Ambassador. Is there something I can do for you, Earth Clan? Why so cranky? You seem to have a bit of a chip on your shoulder, Din. You humans are new to the Citadel, and yet the Council has granted you great favor. <sighs> Chastising rebuke, Din. Your species has always been granted many concessions. Yeah, call them out. Call them out. Volus territory has expanded tenfold since coming to the Citadel. <laughs> Details. We still have no real say in the decisions that affect Citadel space. Yeah. Goodbye, Ambassador. Because you suck. Yes, We're the best. Yes. Good day, Earth Clan. Yes, yes. Good day, Earth Clan. I don't like how fucking condes condescending you sound, sure. I'll fucking end you. Murder you in cold blood. What is in here? Okay, can't go in there. Open sesame. Welcome to the Presidium. Allow me to be your guide. Hello, Alvina. Hello, Alvina. Welcome to the Presidium. My name is Avina, Alvina. and I am pleased to be your virtual Alvina. guide throughout this level of the Citadel Space Station. Uh, no thanks. I don't need a guide. Our records indicate this is your first time on the Citadel. A brief orientation session is customary. Please allow me to do my job. 
So are you a person or a program? <laughs> are you real? I am a fully interactive virtual intelligence programmed to provide spontaneous guidance at predetermined locations of interest throughout this level of the Citadel. I may also be contacted through any of the Presidium VI terminals, should you require assistance. I'll pass. I apologize if you found my service unsatisfactory. I did. Please submit any complaints in writing to the Citadel Tourist and Visitor Board. Have a nice day. Presidium. Citadel Tower. You have arrived at the Citadel Tower. Wow, very nice. Oh, G Dog. Saren's hiding something. Give me more time. Stall them. Stall the council. Don't be ridiculous. Garrus. Your investigation is over, Garrus. Commander Shepard. Garrus Vicarian. I was the officer in charge of the CSEC investigation into Saren. Who were you just talking to? That was Executor Palin, head of Citadel Security, my boss. He'll be presenting my findings on Saren to the Council. What did you find? Across anything I should know about? Saren's a specter. Most of his activities are classified. I couldn't find anything solid. But I know he's up to something. Like you humans say, I feel it in my gut. I think the council's ready for us, Commander. Good luck, Shepard. Maybe they'll listen to you. I wasn't rude to him there because I didn't know if you could, like, uh, recruit him right there or not. I don't remember how that goes. Do not remember how that goes, but I guess not. Uh, missed my chance. Missed my chance. Any loot? Any loot around here? Are you guys hiding any goodies for me to decrypt? Doesn't look like it. Okay, I guess we'll just head up and talk to them. Hello, Anderson. The hearing's already started. Come on. The Geth attack is a matter of some concern, but there is nothing to indicate Saren was involved in any way. The investigation by Citadel Security turned up no evidence to support your charge of treason. An eyewitness saw him kill Nihilus in cold blood. We've read the Eden Prime reports, Ambassador. The testimony of one traumatized dock worker is hardly compelling proof. That's fucking I stupid. I resent these accusations. Nihilus was a fellow Spectre and a friend. That just let you catch him off guard. Captain Anderson. You always seem to be involved when humanity makes false charges against me. And this must be your protege, Commander Shepard. What a bitch. The beacon get destroyed. You're the one who destroyed the beacon. Then you tried to cover it up. Shift the blame to cover your own failures. Just like Captain Anderson. He's taught you well. But what can you expect from a human? You can expect me to kill you the next time we meet. Your species needs to learn its place, Shepard. You're not ready come to here and teach council. show me my You're place, bitch. Let's see what happens. Spectres. He has no right to say that. That's not his decision. Shepard's admission into the Spectres is not the purpose of this meeting. This meeting has no purpose. The humans are wasting your time, counselor, and mine. You can't hide behind the council forever. There is still one outstanding issue. Commander Shepard's vision. It may have been triggered by the beacon. Are we allowing dreams into evidence now? How can I defend my innocence against this kind of testimony? I agree. <sighs> my judgment must be based on facts and evidence, not wild imaginings and reckless speculation. Do you have anything else to add, Commander Shepard? What's the point? You've made your decision. I won't waste my breath. The council has found no evidence of any connection between Saren and the Geth. Fucking dumb. Ambassador, your petition to have him disbarred from the Spectres is denied. I'm glad to see justice was served. Fuck you. Fuck you, this Saren. Fuck is you. You too, Udina. I'll kick you down there. You're kind of annoying. You're just annoying. 
It was a mistake bringing you into that hearing, Captain. You and Saren have too much history. It made the Council question our motives. I know Saren. He's working with the Geth for one reason. To exterminate the entire human race. Every colony we have is at risk. Every world we control is in danger. Even Earth isn't safe. We need to deal with Saren ourselves. As a Spectre, he's virtually untouchable. We need to find some way to expose him. What about Garrus, that CSEC investigator? We saw him arguing with the Executor. That's right. He was asking for more time to finish his report. Seems like he was close to finding something on Saren. He could be Any used. Any idea where we could find him? I have a contact in CSEC who can help us track Garrus down. His name is Harkin. Forget it. They suspended Harkin last month, drinking on the job. I won't waste my time with that loser. You won't have to. I don't want the Council using your past history with Saren as an excuse to ignore anything we turn up. Shepard will handle this. You can't just cut Captain Anderson out of this investigation. The Ambassador's right. I need to step aside. I need to take care of some business. Captain, <coughs> meet me in my office later. Harkin's probably getting drunk at Cora's Den. It's a dingy little club in the lower section of the wards. Maybe there's another way to find evidence against Saren. You should talk to Barla Vaughn over in the financial district. Rumor has it he's an agent for the Shadow Broker. The Shadow Broker? An information dealer. Buys and sells secrets to the highest bidder. I've heard Barla Vaughn's one of the top representatives. He might know something about Saren, but his information won't come cheap. You and Saren have a history. What happened? Yes, give me the about lore details. I Please. was part of a mission in the Skillian Verge. I was working with Saren to find and remove a known terrorist threat. Saren eliminated his target, but a lot of people died along the way, innocent people. And the official records just covered it all up. But I saw how he operates. No conscience, no hesitation. He'd kill a thousand innocent civilians to end a war without a second thought. So would I. Sometimes a thousand people must die so a million can live. But only if there's no other way. Saren doesn't even look for another option. <laughs> so would I. No problem. hesitation. He likes the violence, the killing. And he knows how to cover his tracks. I should go. Good luck, Shepard. I'll be over in the ambassador's office if you need anything else. Okay, we have to go to CSAC, then we have to go talk to fucking Michael Michael Vaughn. Forget his name. The noise was very loud. Ward locations. Or is den. You've arrived at Cora's den. That's him. Oh. Bang, 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 bang. Ow. Bang. You really got I want to loot them, but they don't drop loot in this game on their bodies. Oh my god. Oh no shit. Boom bada bidum boom 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 bada bidum boom 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 beam bada bidum boom boom boom. Sorry, I'll get to you when I can. No, you're fine. I got business here, but not with you. Okay. Go away. I'm not interested in talking. All right, fuck you. Back off, Rex. This told us to take you down if you Rex. Say what are you waiting for? I'm standing right here. This is Fist's only chance. If he's smart, he'll take it. He's not coming out, Rex. End of story. This story is just beginning. Out of my way, humans. I have no quarrel with you. What was that all about? Who knows? Let's just try not to get caught in the middle. Shut up, Ashley. No one asked for your fucking opinion. Fuck you. What's going on here? The back rooms are private. Reserved for Fist and his friends. Who's Fist? He owns this club, but the customers have to stay out front. What did that other Krogan want? 
Rex? Personal matter. Not real chatty, is he? Goodbye. I'm going to point out the obvious, Ashley. You really are adding to the conversation here. All right, hello, Harkin. Military. <laughs> I could have been a Marine, you know. Instead, I joined the goddamn Citadel Security. Biggest mistake of my life. Shh, tell me where Garrus is. Looking for a CSEC officer, a Turian named Garrus. Garrus? <laughs> you must be one of Captain Anderson's crew. Poor bastard still trying to bring Saren down, eh? I know where Garrus is. You gotta tell me something first. Did the captain let you in on his big secret? Don't waste my time. Just tell me where Garrus is before this gets ugly. But it's all related, don't you see? The captain used to be a specter. Didn't know that, did you? It was all very hush-hush. The first human ever given that honor. And then he blew it. Screwed up his mission so bad they kicked him out. Of course, he blames Saren. Says the Turians set him up. <laughs> How do you know this? You said they covered all this up. How'd you hear about it? I spent 20 years working cases here on the Citadel. People on this station love to talk. Secrets are like herpes. If you got them, you might as well spread them around. What? That is literally not what you... What? Who? What kind of fucking logic is that? What kind of fucking... What? What saying is that? Who the fuck says that? There's not a human being on the planet who would ever say... Oh my god. Disgusting. What wasting my time? chance. Tell me where Garrus is now. Okay, settle down. You want to speak to Doctor Michelle over in the med clinic on the other side of the wards. I'm out of here. Yeah, good. Well, this. this motherfucker said it's like having herpes. We got him. Might as well spread him around. No. Is literally not. <laughs> Who the fuck came up with that dialogue? That's what I want to know. I think that's my question at this point in time. Stasis, very good. Uh, reduces the recharge time of. Okay, yeah, no. Get a couple of these. Point to throw. Okay, Caden. Proves recharge time on squad healing. Grants the neural shock ability. Okay, Caden's are a little healer boy. Uh, put assault rifles on you some more. Assault training. There you go. Yeah, I bet you would like to hear what the captain has to say, but I am the fucking commander and you will listen to me, bitch. Where does this take us? The lower markets. This is not where we need to go to. Okay, well, I guess we'll just fucking TP. Where's the TP? There it is. More locations. Med clinic. Wow. I didn't tell anyone, I swear. That was smart, Doc. Now, if Garrus comes around, you stay smart. Keep your mouth shut or we'll... Who are you? Let her go. Oh! Right in the fucking temple. Good shot, Garrus. Ah! 
Haha, <laughs> you can't move, idiot. Oh wait, he's in stasis so I can't kill him. How long does he stay in it for? Oh, he's in there for a while. Okay. <laughs> That's a good... You could free somebody and get uh, get away, which is actually pretty nice. Perfect timing, Shepard. Gave me a clear shot at that bastard. You took him down clean. Sometimes you get lucky. Dr. Michelle, are you hurt? Just read something on no, Twitter okay. and felt like That's I true. lost a brain cell. That's like the average Twitter experience at this point. Why were they threatening you? Who do they work for? They work for Feast. They wanted to shut me up, keep me from telling Garrus about the Quarian. Feast. Uh, what about Saren? Does this have anything to do with the investigation into Saren? I think it might. Dr. Michelle, tell us what happened. A few days ago, a Quarian came by my office. She'd been shot, but she wouldn't tell me who did it. I could tell she was scared, probably on the run. She asked me about oh, the I've seen shit like that a few times. She wanted to trade information in exchange for a safe place to hide. Where is she now? I put her in contact with Fist. He's an agent for the Shadow Broker. Not anymore. Now he works for Saren. And the Shadow Broker isn't too happy about it. Fist betrayed the Shadow Broker? That's stupid even for him. Saren must have made him quite the offer. That Quarian must have something Saren wants. Something worth crossing the Shadow Broker to get. Hmm. What else can you tell me about the Quarian? I'm not sure. Like I said, she wanted to trade information for a place to hide. She didn't... Wait a minute. Geth. Her information had something to do with the Geth. She must be able to link Saren to the Geth. There is no way the Council can ignore this. Uh, we don't have anything yet. Time we paid Fist a visit. This is your show, Shepard. But I want to bring Saren down as much as you do. I'm coming with you. You're a Turian. Why do you want to bring him down? I couldn't There's find a Series X version, right? Yeah. But I knew what was really going on. Yeah, it's on Game Pass. Traitor to the Council and a disgrace to my I people. So, no. uh, okay. Welcome aboard, Garrus. You know we aren't the only ones going after Fist. The Shadow Broker hired a Krogan bounty hunter named Rex to take him out. Yeah, we saw him in the bar. A Krogan might come in handy. Last I heard, he was at the CSEC Academy. What's he doing there? Fist accused him of making threats. We brought Rex in for a little talk. If you hurry, you can catch him at the Academy before he leaves. Move out. Alright. I like how they just spoil who's in the Uh. Okay. We'll take Caden and our boy. Yeah. <clears throat> this is on Game Pass, I believe, but I actually own this. I bought this when this came out on uh, Xbox One. Because Mass Effect's like one of my favorite series. Hey, I know you. You're Shepard, right? This man has Orphan a big head. Why is your neck trade. like that? Why does your neck you look like that? It bothers base. me. Amazing. Looks like you have a fan. I'm sorry. I just never thought I'd meet someone like you in person. Uh, my name's Lang. Officer Eddie Lang, Citadel Security. It's an honor to meet you, Commander. What are you doing down here in the wards? Anything I can help you with? Why is your lip so chapped? I have to go. Right. Please. Probably real busy. Oh. See just, you just if you don't got no chapstick on you just like, a little lick of the lips my brother in christ my brother in christ please it looks like you have been severely dehydrated for 16 millennia in light of the recent attack on eden prime many colonial investors are pulling their support for future projects proponents of expanded human colonization insist that eden prime was an isolated case Nevertheless, look how fast we're going has dropped sharply. 
Many colonial proposals are on hold until backers have some reassurance We're that fucking zooming. colonies will be adequately protected. Welcome to CSEC. Where's old Rexy boy? There he is. Hello, Rex. You join my party, please. Witnesses saw you making threats in Fist's bar. Stay away from him. I don't take orders from you. This is your <laughs> only warning, Rex. You should warn Fist. I will kill him. You want me to arrest you? I want you to try. <laughs> <laughs> Fucking love Rex. Go on. Get out of here. Do I know you, human? My name's Shepard. I'm going after Fist. Thought you might want to come along. <sighs> Shepard. Commander Shepard. Commander Winston Shepard. We're both warriors, Shepard. Out of respect, I'll give you a fair warning. I'm going to kill Fist. Fist knows you're coming. We'll have a better chance if we all work together. My people have a saying. Seek the enemy of your enemy, and you will find a friend. I like that saying. I think we're going to get along just fine, Rex. Let's go. I hate to keep Fist waiting. Well, now I'm torn. Because, like, I want to keep Caden because he's our, our little heel bitch. I love Rex. But I want to bring Garrus. But I love Rex. Bringing Rex. Bringing Rex. Old Rexy boy. Okay, so we can upgrade our people here. Let's see. Krogan Battle Master. Alright. Combat Armor. We put assault rifles. So we can go into shotguns because he uses a shotgun. Uh combat armor. Gives him a shield boost. Nice. Okay. Alright, so we got Rexy Poo. And now wow, where do we go? Uh, med clinic, Cora's Den. I guess back to Cora's Den. Presidium locations. Go to the embassies and talk to the guy about the Shadow Broker. I think we still need to do that. Is that not here? I don't know where that is. For the financials district, maybe. I don't remember where. I guess we can go check. It doesn't hurt to check. Does not hurt to check. C-Sec. Embassies. Okay. What's over here? Welcome. I am Nalina. I don't recognize you as one of our expected clients today would you like me to see when the consort will be able to meet with you can't i just go in mm, i'm afraid not yeah you must understand there are many who seek the consort services but if you wish to leave your name she'll make every effort to meet with you commander shepherd with the alliance navy excellent you should hear something in um three or four months <laughs> you know what sure i think i'm done here Oh, well, I hope you'll return again in the future. We always enjoy seeing new clients. Nalina. Yes, Shaira? Send the commander up to see me. I wish to speak with him. Oh. Yes, of course, mistress. Oh? Huh. It appears the consort has oh? taken notice of you. <laughs> what? Uh, She'd what? like to meet with you now. What does she want to see me for? I don't know. You'll have to ask her yourself. Just head upstairs. She'll be waiting for you. Okay. Say less, I guess. I'm nervous. Why is she... Oh. Why... Oh, oh. I like the dress is very nice. Very cool. We're gonna die. I'm worried. Guns out, boys. 
Who knows what's going to happen here? Is that a bed? What is this? This looks sick. I guess it is a bed. Maybe. Maybe this couch folds out into a bed. That is close enough, Commander. I've heard a great many things about you since your arrival here in our citadel. I don't like people spying on me. I apologize, Commander. I make it my business to know when important people arrive on the station. Many of them become clients. But that is not why I asked you here. I have a certain problem that could use your expertise. Hurry up. Get to the point. I have a friend, Septimus, a retired Turian general. I won't discuss the details, but he wanted me to be more than I could be. We had a falling out. Now he spends his days in Korra's den, drinking and spreading lies about me. If you would speak to him as a fellow soldier, I believe he will listen to you and let the matter be. Who said you could just like touch me like that? <laughs> what on. happened between you? I respect his Lord. privacy too much to go into the details. If he wishes to tell you what happened, that is his prerogative. I'll see. I don't make any promises, but I'll see what I can do. Thank you, Commander. That is all I can ask. Appeal to his sense of honor. Remind him of his position as a general. If you can convince him to stop spreading lies about me, I would be very grateful. Alright. Alright, Winston. Now I must ask you to take your leave. I have many clients waiting to see me. Alright, Winston. You gotta get it in, brother. It is your time. I have to admit I'm a little nervous. That's an issue. I don't think I've played through Mass Effect 1 like a handful of times in my lifetime, and I don't think I've ever went in there and got got that uh that uh that um side quests. Oh, there he is. What's this? One of the Earth Clan. Ah, a very famous one, yes? You are the one called <laughs> Shepard. You were at Torfin, correct? You led the final assault against the enemy base, if memory serves. You spying on me? A little shit. Like strangers a little shit man, huh? Me. Forgive me, Earth Clan. My name is Barla Vaughn. My job makes it necessary for me to keep informed. I am a financial advisor to many important clients here on the Citadel. When someone as important as yourself arrives on the station, I take notice. <coughs> I need info. I've heard you work for the Shadow Broker. Do you have any information about Saren? You're very blunt, Shepard. And you're right. But Rex has already told you far more than I know about this. I am sorry. But I have nothing else to offer. Tell me more about the Shadow Broker. Most people think I deal in finances, but my real currency is knowledge. Mm -mm. I trade information, and it has made me very wealthy. Wow. The Shadow Broker is the true master. Every day he buys and sells secrets that could topple governments, always giving them to the highest bidder. Yet somehow he never seems to upset the natural balance of power. All those secrets being passed around seem to even out. Nobody ends up with an advantage in the end. Who is Can you guess what his identity might be? I don't know. Nobody does. The Shadow Broker could be any race, any gender. I have a theory that it's actually an it could entire be you. group working under one identity. How else could they juggle so many contacts it could at be the same me. time? How else could they keep all that information from getting crossed? But they've got the perfect setup. Every government That's a fair is forced to play their games so they don't get behind. But no matter how long you play, no matter how many secrets you buy, you can never win. But you're I thought you'd know more about the man you work for. From time to time I come across information I sell to the Shadow Broker. That's my only involvement. I like it that way. Fair. The more you know, the more dangerous the game becomes. I don't like danger, Commander. I'll leave that to you. I should go. 
Goodbye, Commander. All right, well, we spoke with him. I guess we go to the thing. So where do we have to go? Cora's Den, I assume. Wards. Uh, Cora's Den. Oh, that's a lot of. Oh, okay. okay, uh, let me barrier up real quick. Didn't want to switch weapons. Let me. You let's throw. Nice. Good knock him down. Very good. Uh shield boost. I see a thing, but I guess it's probably the thing that for the the Asari lady, but since we just murdered everyone, we probably can't talk to him. Yeah. Probably have to come back to do so. Stop right there. Don't come any closer. Warehouse workers. All the real guards must be dead. Stay back or we'll shoot. You're making I a mistake. 50 bodyguards to get in here. What do you think I'll do to you? Uh well, uh <laughs> nah, screw fist. He doesn't pay us enough for this. <laughs> Fuck, I just sat down. Shooting people isn't always the answer. I mean, I kind of agree with old Rexy boy. We could have shot them. X A Y A. Take cover! Oh, shit. We're gonna throw him. We're gonna use barrier. No, I don't think we need to. We'll just have a upper shield. Enemy is everywhere! Wait! Don't kill me, I surrender. Start talking. Tell me where the quarian is, and I won't have to shoot you in the kneecaps. She's not here. I don't know where she is. That's the truth. He's no use to you now. Let me kill him. Wait, wait, I don't know where the Quarian is, but I know where you can find her. The Quarian isn't here, said she'd only deal with the Shadow Broker himself. Face to face? Impossible. Even I was hired through an agent. Nobody meets the Shadow Broker, <clears throat> ever. Even I don't know his true identity. But she didn't know that. I told her I'd set a meeting up. But when she shows up, it'll be Saren's men waiting for her. You son of a bitch. Is before I blow your lying head off. Here on the wards, the back alley by the markets. She's supposed to meet them right now. You can make it if you hurry. Oh my god! The shadow broker paid oh my me god! Me. I don't leave jobs <laughs> half done. A lot of people died because of him. He had it coming. Oh my now let's god! Move. We have to save that quarian. Here we gotta go. Hold on. Y B B Y. Okay, now we go. Gotta go, gotta go, gotta go now. We gotta save Tali. That's a go. I want this door just open. Alright, we're going to barrier up. Uh, everyone just barrier up so we can just fucking ski on that all out of here, you know what I'm saying? Alright. I'm gonna run this way. Uh, 
Okay, go this way. To the lower markets. You can't go up there. It's this way, right? I remember. I wonder what your next game will be. I mean, if I beat Mass Effect 1, I'm going to play Mass Effect 2. They'll be here. The and then no Gaiden will be out more than likely. Because I've been wanting to do a full playthrough of this game series for a while. But I wanted to do other things better. Just set me up. I knew I couldn't trust him. For more. You've got proof Saren is working with the gang. My friend Peppa Pig on the ninth. So fast. Jesus. Who are you? Yeah, no guidance. Only Maybe my friend Peppa Pig. I guess I owe you. But not out here in the open. We need to go somewhere safe. The ambassador's office. It's you become there. a Peppa Pig streamer. You're not making my life easy, Shepard. Firefights in the wards, an all-out assault on Korra's den. Do you know how many... Who's this? A Quarian? What are you up to, Shepard? Shut up and I'll tell this you, Quarian dumb bitch. Help us bring down Saren. I would have told you that if you hadn't jumped down my throat. I apologize, Commander. This whole thing with Saren has me a bit on edge. Maybe we should just start at the beginning, miss... My name is Tali. Tali Zora Naraya. We don't see many Quarians here. Why did you leave the flotilla? I was on my pilgrimage, my rite of passage into adulthood. I like Tali, so we're not going to be too mean. Uh, pilgrimage? I've never heard of this before. It is a tradition among my people. When we reach maturity, we leave the ships of our parents and our people behind. Alone, we search the stars, only returning to the flotilla once we have discovered something of value. In this way, we prove ourselves worthy of adulthood. What kinds of things do you look for? It could be resources like food or fuel, or some type of useful technology, <clears throat> or even knowledge that will make life easier on the flotilla. There's also the baby shark game. Our pilgrimage, we prove what the fuck that we do you do in a baby shark game? Rather than being a burden on our limited resources. What kind of evidence did you find? How did you get it? During my <laughs> travels, I began hearing reports of Geth. Since they drove my people into exile, the Geth have never ventured beyond the Vale. I was so it's coming soon, and that should probably make a lot I of money. I a patrol of Geth to an uncharted world. I waited for one to become separated from its unit. Then I disabled it and removed its memory core. I thought the Geth fried their memory cores when they died. Some kind of defense mechanism. How did you manage to preserve the memory core? My people created the Geth. If you're quick, careful and lucky small caches of data can sometimes be saved most of the core was wiped clean but i salvaged something from its audio banks eden prime was a major victory the beacon has brought us one step closer to finding the conduit oh Saren's shit voice. this proves he was involved we in got him Saren won't get out of this one wait there's more Saren wasn't working alone. Eden Prime was a major victory. The beacon has brought us one step closer to finding the conduit. And one step closer to the return of the Reapers. I don't recognize that other voice, the one talking about Reapers. Reapers sound familiar. I feel like I've heard that name before. According to the Memory Core, the <coughs> Reapers were a hyper-advanced machine race that existed 50,000 years ago. The Reapers hunted the Protheans to total extinction, and then they vanished. At least, that's what the Geth believe. Sounds a little far-fetched. It's not far-fetched. The vision on Eden Prime. I understand it now. I saw the Protheans being wiped out by the Reapers. The Geth revere the Reapers as gods, the pinnacle of non-organic life. And they believe Saren knows how to bring the Reapers back. The Council is just going to love this. 
They won't believe you anyway. Just keep them out of this. We have to tell them. Even if they don't believe anything else, this proves Saren is a traitor. The captain's right. We need to present this to the Council right away. What about her? The Quarian? My name is Tali. Yeah, get it right, Rex. You saw me in the alley, Commander. You know what I can do. Let me come with you. Hell yeah, and what about your quest, though? I thought you were on your pilgrimage. The pilgrimage proves we are willing to give of ourselves for the greater good. What does it say about me if I turn my back on this? Saren is a danger to the entire galaxy. My pilgrimage can wait. I'll Join us. The help I can get. Thanks. Nice. You won't regret this. I know I won't, Tali. Anderson and I will go ahead to get things ready with the council. Take a few minutes to get to yourself. Motherfucker. In the tower. Why is everyone so ashy in this game? Alright. Alright, so Tali. Uh let's see. There go Tali. And I guess Caden for now. I wanna see it. I don't know what she can do. I don't remember. Okay, she can do get first aid as well. She increases squad healing. Restores HP. Mama the boom the man. Okay, so get her decryption up she, she's basically like fucking she has the same shit as Aiden, so it's kind of redundant to have both of them to be honest okay do that for now Let's look at our stuff. Okay, any upgrades for me? Does not look like it. Okay, what about you? You already have a Lancer one. Doesn't Tali use a shotgun? I give her a shotgun. I think she like primarily uses a shotgun if I remember correctly. I know she can use anything, but give her a pistol as well and look at you. Okay. Oh, uh, let's do a save real quick. Okay. Now we have to go see the council. Go tell him that Saren is a bad boy. He's a little baddie. I'm a baddie, but baddie, baddie. Samesh ba. Excuse me, Commander yes. Shepard. Could you spare a moment of your time? Commander Shepard, my name is Samesh Patti. Let's see if I can go back Forgive to the, the course then. But I have nowhere else to turn. A lot of people want my help these days. What makes you special? Yeah, I'm pretty popular. My wife was a Marine. She was in the 212 on Eden Prime. The 212? Isn't that Ashley's unit? She might want to meet Mr. Bhatia. I've requested that my wife's body be returned to me for cremation, but the military has refused my request. Why did they refuse your request? There's got to be some reason. I don't know. The All trash. I know is that they have declared it impossible for my wife to be returned to me. I'm concerned with the living, not the dead. I don't have time for this. I understand. You have many important things to do. If you do have time, however, Mr. Bosco is the man in charge of my case. He's in the expensive bar over there. Thank you for your time. I just want to give my wife a proper funeral and the respect she deserves. The expensive bar over there, motherfucker? You just pointed in a direction. Where is there an expensive bar? It in here expensive bar chain where are you no diplomat clerk bartender 
my the rumors. The consort would never reveal her secrets. Of course she wouldn't. She'd be tossed out the nearest airlock if she did. Uh, I suppose. Besides, Nick, the consort's nothing like the girls back on the colonies. <laughs> she's she's You don't have to do it with her. You can just talk to her if you want. Is that all you did, Jazz? Just <clears throat> I didn't say that. Ha! I bet you did too. What do you <clears throat> want? Oh, Commander. <laughs> yeah, you better watch who the fuck you're talking to, you. fucking ginger boy. Relax, Private. This isn't an inspection. Right, sorry. What can I do for you, Commander? What can you tell me about the Asari consort? I, uh, well, she's an Asari who works here as, that is, she helps people with things. You never went to see her, did you, Fredericks? I, uh, no, I never did. Uh, I couldn't afford it. It costs half a year's credits just to go in and talk to her. Okay, well, we know That's where the consort is. Just tell me where Because we find. talked to her already. Sure. She's across the bridge from the embassies. Yeah, yeah, we already know that. My goodness, you're Commander Shepard. Your activities made for quite a briefing in the diplomatic corps. Is there something I can do to assist you? <laughs> Stop stealing you corpses. You the red tape for a grieving husband. I want you to release the body of Nerali Bacha. Commander, nothing would make me happier. I'm afraid, though, that it's <laughs> no, not you. quite that simple. Stop Service stealing Nerali corpses. Died on Eden Prime, Stop. As Mr. Bacha no doubt told you. Her wounds are inconsistent with any type of weapon damage we've seen before. That is why her body is being held. I don't care how badly the Geth mangled the body. It's the husband's right to claim her. We are not holding Nerali Batia's body out of discretion. We are, frankly, holding the body for research. The tests we're conducting may lead to better defenses against Geth attacks. Respectfully, serviceman Batia may save more lives in death than she did in life. I'm releasing the body. You know who and what I am. If I want Nerali Batia, I can get her. Commander, I, I don't think threats are necessary. Uh, even if the body were here on the Citadel, would you really risk going in shooting to get it? Yes, I would. briefed on me. How far do you think I'm willing to go on this? All right, Commander. Yeah, we would. I love me, dude. I'm not going to risk an incident by refusing. I love being fucking me. The body is being shipped back to Earth. I'll go now to see to it myself. Yeah, that's what I fucking thought, bitch. Know your fucking place. Know your fucking role. Don't ever fucking raise your voice to me again, you ugly bitch. Fucking idiot. I am Winston Shepard. You will fucking respect me. Hello again, Commander. Has there been any word? Your wife is coming home, Mr. Batya. Thank you. I will return home and begin my preparations. It does not bring me happiness. But it may bring me peace. Goodbye, Commander. The funny thing is that that might have implications to the game later. Of like a Geth attack. But I was mean and it made me giggle. And that's all that matters. Ah, oh, it's a good this place is up and running again so fast. Is this Commander? What do you want? What's bothering you, General? I've seen a lot of horrible things in my days, and I'm gonna go for I Topaz's like oh, really? This damn galaxy that <clears> helps me forget it. Then why create rumors and lies about this woman? Fair enough. Because she rejected me. Me! Septima Soraka, general of the Turian fleet. Some general. What kind of example are you to your troops? The troops can kiss my leathery backside. All I wanted was to retire and be with her. <laughs> Look, kid, I appreciate what, what you're trying simp. to do, but don't waste your time. Get a grip. Never let the enemy see your weakness. You know that, General. Enemies. The one oh, like 50 50 could be a positive thing. True. There's some good fucking, uh. But now, there's some so good light code. It's that easy. Just straighten up and act like a general. I don't think it could hurt. Huh. 
Maybe you're right, Commander. Shaira's worth the effort. Even if she won't have me back. Now get up and get moving, General. All right. I'll go to her. After I've had a cold shower or two. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Say, you're a bright kid. Would you be interested in earning a few extra credits? I've already got a lot on my plate, General. You sure? It's a simple job. It won't take you long at all. What do you want me to do? There's an Elcor diplomat out there who believes Shaira gave up his secrets. <laughs> Why would he think such a thing? Because I told him. Look, I Jesus. just need to convince him of the truth. Why can't you tell him yourself? Well, the last time he saw me, I... I was disparaging his ancestors and shouting his secrets in public. <laughs> this guy's such an asshole. It shows where I got my info. It will exonerate Shaira and convince the Elcor. Keep your data pad. I don't have time for this. Come on, it'll only take you a minute. Fine. You're God, you're place. such a little whiny bitch. His you're a general? Zaltan. He's an Elcor diplomat. He's over in the embassies complaining about Shaira. Well, here's to soldiers acting like soldiers. You're such a bitch. Thanks, Commander. You know, you might make a good general yourself one day. God, what a little baby, bro. This man was just whining. Wah, wah, wah. Fucking wah, wah, wah. And some four temples, all pity. 100%. You know, like unfair. Yeah, I would like to get <clears throat> fucking Japards like on TBH. Uh, the embassies. One bad thing about Topaz is like gun though. What? I haven't even like looked at it, so I know nothing about it. They nerfed her. Like her actual fucking abilities or, or her looks in some way shape or form oh yeah that light gun yeah that light gun is really cute i don't see how they nerfed her though <clears throat> All right, we need to find the Elcor. He censored the cleavage. Well, to be fair, when are you ever actually going to just be looking at the light cone? <laughs> Human delighted welcome. It is Other than when you pull it. Here, no, it's over here. Hello. Hello there, human. Sincere apology, but I am here on business and cannot be distracted right now. I've come to talk to you about your little problem. Curious. What do you know about the consort and her relationship to me? The consort didn't reveal your secret. It was a Turian named Septimus. Oh Unbelieving, I know this Septimus, and he could not learn my secrets. <clears throat> the only way he could learn them is from the Asari consort. You are mistaken. See this here if you don't believe us. Confused. This is difficult to fathom. If the Turian could learn this on his own, dismayed. Anyone can discover my secret. 
Just make sure you leave Shaira out of it from now on. Agreed, most assuredly. It is clear that the consort was blameless. Startled realization. I must speak with the consort. She will be most displeased with my actions. I'm sure she will. Anxious request. Please, human, if you will excuse me, I must go now. Whatever. So long. Farewell, human. Thankful. That was a great thing you did, Commander. Approving. <clears throat> you see, then not all humans are as you say. I'm sure the Earth Clan stands abroad. Yeah, I'm real nice. I've never heard a fly, never did anything. Let's go talk to the consort. If I talk, I think we're gonna bang the consort. Big bugs. I've been playing this game for two hours. I'm ready about the bang somebody. Gotta love Mass Effect. Uh, was it a wards location or Presidium? Presidium. Back. I did the deed you asked of me, Consort Chan. All right, let's go. Commander, no. I recently received a lovely note from Septimus. Thank you for speaking with him. Even the Alcor diplomat has withdrawn his campaign against me. Let's talk payment. I can't spend gratitude. I would not dream of letting you go without payment. I do not make a habit of incurring debts. These credits will cover your expenses. I also have one more thing to give you, if you are interested. What is it? What are you offering me? I offer a gift of words, an affirmation of who you are and who you will become. I see the sadness behind your eyes. It tells a story that makes me want to weep, pain and loss, but it drives you, makes you strong. You never hide your strength either. It serves you well terrifies your foes few will dare to stand against you this may be who you are yeah i'm, but it is not I'm pretty i'm pretty scary it only forms people should fear me yes. greatness remember these words when doubt descends commander that's it uh thanks i guess close your eyes and relax commander oh no she's gonna eat my mind oh oh What is going on? What is going on here? Tali, Caden, don't look. <laughs> Mass Effect sex speedrun beat. In light Big of your pog. efforts with the Elcor ambassador, I would like you to have this small trinket. Trinket? What is it? A small mystery. I have never learned its use or purpose, but I sense it is time for me to pass it on. And now I must ask you to leave. I have done everything I can for you. Remember my words, Commander Shepard. Oof. They will give you strength. Oh, well, I'll remember. Don't worry. <laughs> gotta get her to intimidate up more i love this game all right uh let's go here to unlock pistols i want to unlock lift so we're gonna put some more into throw as well all right tolly we're gonna put some into first aid for you girl because we're probably gonna use you for a while and put more into decryption so we can get the hacking Kaden, let's see. I'll put something to throw for you, I guess. <clears throat> All right, do 
a little save, why not? Lit. Okay, now we can go to the Citadel Tower. To go tattle on fucking Saren. Just had to fucking... Make a little visit to the consort. <laughs> I'm dying? Okay. Uh, Presidium locations. A Citadel Tower. Been watching someone play Spider-Man. Oh, uh, yeah. And just fucking my whole TikTok feed has just been Spider-Man. Like, I don't want to look at it because, like, I was like, eh, maybe I'll play it one day, but... No, I'm waiting to speak, Commander. I'm tempted to just buy the first Spider-Man just to swing around. That'd be the whole stream. Just fucking... Just fucking swing. Story is rush time, um, I think so. Udina's presenting the Quarian's evidence to the council. I haven't seen anyone talking about the story at all. Eden just mostly gameplay and like the way it looks. I haven't heard anything about the story. One step closer to finding the conduit. And one step closer to the return of the Reapers. You wanted proof? There it is. This evidence is irrefutable, Ambassador. Saren will be stripped of his Spectre status, and all efforts will be made to bring him in to answer for his crimes. I recognize the other voice, the one speaking with Saren. Matriarch Benezia. Who's she? Matriarchs are powerful Asari who have entered the final stage of their lives. Revered for their wisdom and experience, they serve as guides and mentors to my people. Matriarch Benezia is a powerful biotic, and she had many followers. She will make a formidable ally for Saren. I'm more interested in the Reapers. What do you know about them? Only what was extracted from the Geth's memory core. The Reapers were an ancient race of machines that wiped out the Protheans. Then they vanished. The Geth believe the Reapers are gods, and Saren is the prophet for their return. We think the Conduit is the key to bringing them back. You get 100% the game Saren's in the time it takes you to complete the first game's story? Back. Really? Do we even know what this conduit is? Saren thinks he can bring back the Reapers. That's, That's kind of crazy. Enough. Listen to what you're saying. Saren wants to bring back the machines that wiped out all life in the galaxy? Impossible. It has to be. Where did the Reapers go? Why did they vanish? How come we found no trace of their existence? Where's your ears? Real, There's a lot of questions something. that need to be answered here, sir. I tried to warn you about Saren, and you refused to face the truth. Don't make the same mistake again. This is different. You proved Saren betrayed the Council. We all agree he's using the Geth to search for the Conduit, but we don't really know why. The Reapers are obviously just a myth, Commander. A convenient lie to cover Saren's true purpose. A legend he is using to bend the Geth to his will. Fifty thousand years ago, the Reapers wiped out all galactic civilization. If Saren finds the conduit, it will happen again. Saren is a rogue agent on the run for his life. He no longer has the rights or resources of a Spectre. The Council has stripped him of his position. That is not good enough. You know he's hiding somewhere in the Traverse. Send your fleet in! A fleet cannot track down one man. A Citadel fleet could secure the entire region, keep the Geth from attacking any more of our colonies. Or it could trigger a war with the Terminus systems. We won't be dragged into a galactic confrontation over a few dozen human colonies. Same Every old time story. humanity asks for help, you ignore us. Shepard's right. I'm sick of this council and its yeah. anti-human bull- Ambassador. Oh. There is another solution. A way to stop Saren that does not require fleets or armies. No. It's too Bullshit, so let him say it. ready for the responsibilities that come with joining the Spectres. It was a Turian Spectre who betrayed this council, and it was a human who exposed him. I've earned this. Yeah, you fucking bitch. Sit the fuck down. Know the fuck you're talking to. It's Winston Shepard, bitch. All right? Make me a Spectre right now. Commander Shepard, step forward. See this fucking mohawk, brother? I earned this. I earned this mohawk. Out on the field of war.
It is the decision of the Council that you be granted all the powers and privileges of the Special Tactics and Reconnaissance Branch of the Citadel. Spectres are not trained, but chosen. Individuals forged in the fire of service and battle. Those whose actions elevate them above <coughs> the rank and file. Spectres are an ideal, a symbol, the embodiment of courage, determination, and self-reliance. They are the right hand of the Council, instruments of our will. Spectres bear a great burden. They are protectors of galactic peace, both our first and last line of defense. The safety of the galaxy is theirs to uphold. You are the first human Spectre, Commander. This is a great accomplishment for you and your entire species. About damn time. I've been ready for this since Eden Prime. Well, that's a lie because... Uh, uh, what's his face was a Spectre? From justice, so you are authorized to use any means necessary Apparently. to apprehend or eliminate him. Any idea where to find him? We will forward any relevant files to Ambassador Udina. This meeting of the Council is adjourned. Congratulations, Commander. We've got a lot of work to do, Shepard. You're going to need a ship, a crew, supplies. You'll get access to special equipment and training now. You should go down to the CSEC Academy and speak to the Spectre Requisitions Officer. Anderson, come with me. I'll need your help to set all this up. Nice. Story needed an extra 10 to 15 I hours. I did see that a lot of people were beating it pretty fast. What do you expect from a politician? Come on. Right behind you, Commander. Spectre bonus, Spectre tree talent. Nice. I'm a Spectre. Spectre deflector. I guess we can go to the CSEC real quick and see the Spectre deflector acquisitions. Even though I'm pretty sure they're like hella ex really expensive. If I would remember correctly. Welcome to CSEC. Is this an elevator? Damn it. So many elevators. Trying to figure out where to go. Yeah, I did see that people were beating this new Spider-Man game relatively quick. Okay, Jaleed. Let me get this straight. Your business partner, Shorley, he's threatened you? Well, no. Speak with the ambassador. <laughs> but he wants to meet with me. I think he's going to kill me. And why do you think that? I... I can't really get into the details. But Shorbin will kill me if I leave here unprotected. Hey there! Oh, you're not CSEC, are you? Did you want something? No. I think I'll be going. Oh, alright then. <laughs> no. I've already put 52 hours into the PS5 version of Star Rail. Jeez. I think I have like. Um, maybe like 15, 20. I think like 20. Elevator to the Presidium. Where does this go? Elevator to the docking bay. So I think this takes me down to where I need to go. I think I only have like. Academy. In other news, ExogeniCorp is still denying reports that one of their survey teams has gone missing in the Hades Gamma Cluster. When at Since the PS timer's not... Yeah, it is pretty inaccurate. Especially, I think if we play offline too, it doesn't count for some time. You know, this ain't it. Right, whatever. I already have almost like a hundred hours in fucking uh cyberpunk. Is it true humans stopped using the biotic implants you were fitted with? Lieutenant? From how often I've been playing Biotics it. Biotics can be pretty bad, and I'm one of the lucky L2 implants. The stream was like the the stream playthrough was like sixty hours. That makes sense. 
What use is harnessing and that then, power if it causes more harm think I have good like, to your people? And then I think um my other playthrough is like over twenty hours now. Oh, here we are. One sec, looking you up. Yeah, when I bought it, I didn't play it until I opened it for uh to fucking check Commander settings Shepherd, like the day before stream. Military. First time on the Citadel, that about right? Who wants before to I started streaming it. For CSEC records, I can only sell goods to authorized personnel. So, will you be purchasing anything today, Commander Shepard? Show me what you've got. Sounds good. Just let me set you up. Well, this must be a mistake. System's telling me to offer you our select stock. Spectre? Well, I heard about that, but I didn't realize it was you. Sorry, Commander. Just show me what you've got. I'll open the rare stocks for you, Commander. Disrespect Enjoy. my Mohawk again. See what the fuck happens to you, bitch. Fucking end you. I'll end you right now. Pretty sure I have, like, no money. I'm broke. Yeah, I'm poor as fuck. Hello, Commander. Actually, Show me what you've got. I'll open the rare stocks for you, Commander. Enjoy. I've 78 on Schizo Simulator. <clears throat> yeah, I have 2,500. But as soon as the next gen came out, uh, that, buy that. You know, I I put a lot of hours into like a dragon to the docking bay. An excavation team has run into an unexpected problem after unearthing a Prothean dig site. Yeah, the timer like is weird. Have blockaded the dig site. I like that there is a timer though. It's pretty cool. I think you're keeping track of time, other things. I play. I've got big news for you, Shepard. Captain Anderson is stepping down as commanding officer of the Normandy. The ship is yours now. She's quick and quiet, and you know the crew. Perfect ship for a Spectre. Treat her well, Commander. This isn't right. The Normandy belongs to you. You needed your <clears> own <throat> ship. A Spectre can't answer to anyone but the Council. Police station says 79, while the safe says 106. Yeah, I don't know what's like. What uh, you know. There's more to this. Come clean with me, Captain. You owe me that much. I don't know how it works necessarily. Ago, they were considering me for the Spectres. Because it's so inconsistent. Why didn't you ever mention this? What was I supposed to say? I could have been a Spectre, but I blew it. I failed, Commander. It's not something I'm proud of. Ask me later, and I'll tell you the whole story. For now, all you need to know is I was sent on a mission with Saren. Mail and count when you put inputs. Oh, true. Because you could just AFK shot. in a game and have like a bajillion hours ago. Now you have a chance to make up for my mistakes. Saren's not going to get away this time. Saren's gone. Don't even try to find him. But we know what he's after. The what a mistake. He's got his Geth scouring the traverse looking for clues. <sighs> we had reports of Geth in the Pharaoh system shortly before our colony there dropped out of contact. And there have been sightings around Noveria. <laughs> Find out what Saren was after on Pharos and Noveria. Maybe you can figure out where the conduit is before he does. The Reapers are the real threat. I'm with the Council on this one, Shepard. I'm not sure they even exist. But if they do exist, the conduit's the key to bringing them back. Stop Saren from getting the conduit, and we stop the Reapers from returning. I'll stop him. We have one more lead, Matriarch Benezia, the so other voice of that recording. How so? She has a daughter, a scientist who specializes in the Protheans. We don't know if she's involved, but it might be a good idea to try and find her. See what she knows. Her name's Liara, Dr. Liara Tassoni. We have reports she was exploring an archaeological dig on one of the uncharted worlds in the Artemis Tau Cluster. Sounds like we should head for the Artemis Tau Cluster. It's your decision, Commander. You're a Spectre now. Gotta go get Don't answer to us. the girl. But your actions still reflect on humanity as a whole. 
You make a mess and I get stuck cleaning it up. Oh, right. Oh, true. You know what? You're right. I forgot about that. Completely forgot about that. There we go. That's your job. I'll take care of Sarin. You take care of the political fallout. Not exactly the answer I was looking for, Shepard. Remember, you were a human long before you were a specter. I have a meeting to get to. Captain Anderson can answer any questions you might have. Uh, fuck you, Captain. Let me look at my new ship. Stand by, shore party. Decontamination in progress. I heard what happened to Captain Anderson. Yeah, survives a hundred battles and gets taken down by backroom politics. And they die a few times and lost progress. If things go bad on this mission, you're next on their chopping block. Saren's out there somewhere. And we're gonna find him. Everyone on this ship's behind you, Commander. 100%. Intercom's open. You got anything you want to say to the crew? It's always a fucking. Can't, I hate losing progress when I die. Now we do things my way. Listen up, Normandy. This is your commander speaking. We have our orders. Find Saren before he finds the conduit. And I refuse to let anything get in the way of that mission. The council wants to ignore this. That's no surprise. They've never helped us in the past. No reason they'd start now. But we don't need their help. We can do this on our own. Saren can't hide from Wherever us. Wherever Saren goes, we'll follow. Wherever he searches for the conduit, we'll be there. We will hunt him to the very ends of the galaxy and bring him down. I think my most played PlayStation 5 game is probably NBA. NBA in 2K23. I think I had like two, three hundred hours on that. None of the other species has the guts, grit, or balls to deal with this. So it's up to us. We're the only ones who can stop Saren. I swear to you all, we will stop him. Well said, Commander. Captain will be proud. The captain's not here. I'm in charge now, Joker, and time's wasting. Get this bird in the air. <laughs> yes, sir. Yeah, fuck the captain. He's a bitch. I'm captain now. This is a 385 hours in one game. I think one of the NBAs, I think I own two NBA 2Ks on PlayStation since I got mine. And I think I put over 200 hours in both of them. So it's surprising because I never feel like I play those games a lot, but. Played enough to put 200 hours in, but I want, I kind of want, um. The game using a sports or multiplayer game? What game? Which one do I have to go to for her? God, I forget. Finally, Artisani. Explore the Uncharted War. Oh, I have to just. Okay. She's in one of the clusters. Damn. Speaking of games that I have an unfucking fathomable amount of hours in, 
I've been getting that Destiny 2 itch again. Just a little bit. Just a little tiny bit. No. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I don't. I'm, I really don't want to. <clears throat> I really just don't want to download it on my PC, to be honest with you. Picking up a signal from the planet's surface. It looks like an automated distress beacon. Boom, 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 boom. What fucking planet is she on? I'm not doing this fucking nonsense. Looking, I don't remember. <laughs> game it is a little indie game that many has heard of. Fuck she at? We're not doing this shit. Where is Leo? Something called Persona 5 Royal. You know what? It makes sense. I don't think I have that many hours in Persona. Alright, we'll take Tali and Rex. I think I only have like the 120 something that I played on stream. Probably. I definitely know it's not my most played. driving this thing I hate driving the Mako smoke smoke never changes dot I can't see that over there though okay because like you can like go through every planet and just fucking search for Liara and I think there's some stuff you could do but fuck that noise look at that geth ship shooter breaker is just about right 105 starfield looks pretty outdated if only starfield had fucking vehicles Are you telling me how to fucking do my job? <clears throat> I 
Ah! Pea shooter. Level up, nice. Bitch. Get two playthroughs for the plan. Oh, that's fair. Bitch. Easy clap. I mean, don't even know if I knew that you could drive around. Who's shooting me? I think I have to get out to go in here to open this gate. If I remember correctly. Almost threw a grenade again. Get out of my way. B X A B. Nice. Okay, let me put my gun away. Okay. Down the ramp. Come on. How do I get in? How do I get back into this? Oh. oh okay. Oh, mega low. Alright. How's this, this motherfucker? You are so far. How are you, how are you aggro to me? I can't even get a fucking... Couldn't even get the health bar to show up. He's aggro to me. Fucking rude. Look at that one. I can't even see that one in shooting at me. Who the fuck made the AI in this game? By your word, Doko. Okay, cool. The strike is that fun playing, but it's not something I have to urge to get back to. Plus, you need to do specific builds to be able to play. It becomes piss easy and not very enjoyable. Oh, that's fair. Shooting you in your head. Are you not dead? Die. Come on, I know I'm hitting you. There we go. Yeah, I mean, Strikers, I will definitely do a Strikers playthrough eventually at the end. The wheel just has to deem it worthy, I guess. Mass Effect's been on the wheel, like, for a while. <laughs> so I'm surprised it actually got it. Because originally I was going to go back to Mass Effect 2 because that's what we got up to in the last time I was doing the playthrough of all the series. But that was on PC on Steam. And since I own the, since I have a Series X now, I said I might as well just fucking just play it on here. Why not? I don't feel like downloading it on my PC. Can you die faster? Oh yeah, I forgot I have rockets. <laughs> I thought I crashed the game. <laughs> Geth Rocket Trooper. What do you think was going to happen? Give me XP.
Everywhere I go, there's always something to love me. I wish there was music. You don't have a fucking radio in this Mako? Where the fuck is minion sex when you need it? One day, I'm gonna be talking about minion sex. And a random person's gonna come into the stream and just be like, what the fuck is he talking about? Why is he talking about minions fucking? VTuber, why? VTuber, why do you talk about minions? Fuck! VTuber! VTuber! Or make sure it's October, what do you talk about minion? Fuck. Weird. Weird Cancel this VTuber. He talks about minions. Fuck. Oh, there we go. Now we have some tunes. Hey. Hey, oh, is there a sniper? Don't worry. Move, Rex, you big bitch! Ow, what the fuck hit me? Holy shit. Oh, that's a rocket! Oh! God damn it. Get the shock trooper, get him. Get him, get him, get him, get him, get him. Nice, 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 nice. Level, 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 level. Whoa! Hit him, hit him, get him. Focus fire him. Now focus fire on him. Go, 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 go. Focus fire, focus fire, focus fire. Throw the nade. Get it out, get it out! Alright. No one panicked. <clears throat> See, confused person. They won't be honest that much. I don't know how to use them. Oh my god. Stop. Oh. Nice. Alright, hold on. I leveled up like twice there. Okay. Do that. Spectre training. Put a couple in the spectre training. I'm gonna put some into pistols here and then put one in there. And then for Rex, uh, do Krogan Battlemaster. Um, increases health. Okay, yeah. Be a little tanky boy with your shotgun. And for Tali, we'll put some more into first aid for her. Put some into electronics and decryption so we get hacking. Okay. Nice. This pistol is so good, actually. Speaking of, did I get anything new? I have a new pistol. Okay, none of them is stronger than this pistol. I just like using a pistol. Oh wait, this is with the big fucking bitch, isn't it? This might be a little rough. I have no nades either, that's fucking oofy. Sorry, 
here, boys. This might be a little bit of a struggle, not gonna lie. Can I go get my Mako? All right, everyone focus fire. Focus fire, go, go, go. Actually, no. Actually, don't go, go, go yet. Um. Okay, see that thing? Kill it. <laughs> Kill it with fire, please. Okay, we're going to, um, I'm going to barrier since we're getting fucking got a little bit here. Where's, am I getting sniped? Did my gun stop fucking jamming? That'd be bonkers. Please, dude. Stop it! Why is my gun jamming so much? Uh, so annoying! Kill this fucker. Kill that thing. Kill it. Kill it with fire, please. Oh god, oh shit, oh god. Okay, we're gonna hide over here. I'm gonna do this. I'm gonna switch to this uh, okay all right got him down got him down yeah, I gotta, gotta, gotta get this other one oh my god please stop fucking jumping around fuck you stupid little bitch oh god I'm almost dead Okay, we're going to shield boost. We're going to shield boost. Oh no. Yeah, use AI hacking, I guess. Whatever that does. Um, and then we're going to switch back to my pistol. And we don't have those little shits. Rex, don't die, please. You're supposed to be a tank. this fucking thing down. Ow! What is shooting at me? <laughs> oh, Sakuma! Is there a sniper in that fucking tower? Yeah, there is. Run. Ugh. Nice, we got it, we got it, we got it. Awesome. Finish off the fucking stragglers. Fucking oof. Alright, that was close. A little closer than I would've liked, you know what I'm saying? A little bit closer than I would have liked, but we did it. Everyone smile. Save. Save. Okay, very good. Uh, let's upgrade this bad boy a little bit more, shall we? Max accuracy, weapon stability. Um... High caliber, 14 damage, rate of fire goes down, and heat absorption. I'd rather the heat absorption, to be honest. So I can just keep fucking letting that shit fly. Black hole. Oh 
Why do you run like that, Shepard? Whoa, hey, oh, hey! Fucking shooting rockets like that, motherfucker! Watch where the fuck you're shooting them things, brother. Okay, nice. Ow! My ass. stand in formation god damn it i'm fucking up the formation i'm sorry yes we got another meta gel awesome we done it Tommy, are you dead? How are you dead? Focus on that one. Hit that one. Hit that one. Hit that one. How are you dead? Oh my god. Fuck. Alright, you're in stasis. Can I fucking heal you fuckers? No. Can I not heal you guys? Ow, 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 Keep it down! Quit shouting. This place is crawling with Geth. Sorry, I am a little... Look, my name is Dr. Liara Tassoni. I am an archaeologist. Listen, this thing I'm in is a Prothean security device. I cannot move, so I need you to get me out of it, alright? Uh, how'd you get how'd trapped? You up in there? I was exploring the ruins when the Geth showed up, so I hid in here. Can you believe that? Geth, beyond the veil! I oh, we believe the tower's it. Defenses. I knew the barrier curtains would keep them out. When I turned it on, I must have hit something I wasn't supposed to. I was trapped in here. You must get me out, please. Any suggestions on how we can help? There is a control in here that should deactivate this thing. You'll have to find some way past the barrier curtain. That's the tricky part. The defenses cannot be shut off from the outside. I don't know how you'll get in here. Be careful. There is a Krogan with the Geth. They have been trying different ways oh, to get right. past the barrier. Fucking Krogan, dude. Or the Krogans are fucking annoying. Cause they just regen health like fucking little baby octopuses. Can y'all not die again, please? Can you die? 
die? Okay. Just a little bit. Little. There we go. <laughs> At least we're getting meta gel back pretty handily. All right, everyone's topped off. In the override, why, why, why be? In the override, Y A X X Y A X. Nice. Yeah, let's see your guys' weapons. I don't think I actually change your guys' weapons. All right. Do we have any armor for you, brother? Don't. Sorry. I'm so sorry. Uh, here, you can have this scimitar. And, um... Tali. Here, you can have, I don't know what you'll be using, but you can have this Avenger. Sniper rifle does more damage than mine, so I'm taking it. got some new upgraded weapons i don't know why you're using a sniper ollie but you know what that's you feel like hitting some fucking gillium cams and i'm all for it. A X B Y A A X B Y A X B Y B A X B Y Y A X B Y X Nice Just fucking keep pressing shit until something works my favorite kind of puzzles. Are we going up or is this coming down? Oh no, I think we're going up. All right, Liara, we're here. How? How did you get in here? Did you not hear the I fucking laser? Anyway past the barrier. Superior firepower. We blasted through with the mining laser. Of course. Yes, that makes sense. Please, get me out of here before more Geth I don't know how you didn't hear that the fucking laser. should shut down this containment field. Not so fast, Shepard. You sure she's on our side? Her mother's working with Saren. I am not my mother. I don't even... I don't know why Benezia joined Saren. I don't want anything to do with that Turian bastard. We need her. If she was with Saren, the Geth wouldn't be trying to kill her. Oof. Fucking oof. Any idea 
how we get out of this place? There is an elevator back in the center of the tower. At least I, I think it's an elevator. It should take us out of here. Come on! I, I still cannot believe all this. Why would the Geth come after me? Do you think Benezia's involved? Seren's looking for the conduit. You're a Prothean expert. He probably wants you to help him find it. The conduit? But I don't know... Why does Liara have such nice eyes? Fucking... Such nice, nice eyes. That mining laser must have triggered a seismic event. They're like fucking, the fucking huge. The whole place is caving in. Massive. Uh, the iris. We need an escape plan. Joker, get the Normandy airborne and lock in on my signal. On the double, Mister. Aye, aye, Commander. Secure on the double, Mister. ETA eight minutes. He needs to move faster. If I die in here, I'll kill him. Rex is such a fucking mood. Oh, we're, night we're in a nice little conga line now. Very cool. Changing up our pattern. I like it. Never let him know your next move. It's a Krogan. This motherfucker is a pain in the ass. Surrender. Or don't. That would be more fun. Kill this we bastard. Don't have time to deal with this idiot. Charge! <sighs> I like your attitude. Yeah, well, I don't like yours, little bitch, baby. Oh, wow, I got an achievement. Fuckers. Overload. It's overkill. I use. I'm gonna use barrier. Then I'm going to use marksman. Gotta get them out of the fucking battle. Real right away. <laughs> fucking out of the battle right away. Oh, fucking bitch, bitch. Oh. Oh, Oni Chan. Oni Chan. Oh. Oh, 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 oh. Please heal me. <laughs> Fucking get snipers, dude. Fuck you. Absolutely destroyed that Krogan. <laughs> Instant destruction. Go, go, go. We got to get out of there. Go. Commander, in 10 more seconds we would have been swimming in molten sulfur. The Normandy isn't equipped to land in exploding volcanoes. They tend to fry our sensors and melt our hull. Just for future reference. We almost died out there and your pilot is making jokes? Sometimes Joker's a real ass. Just try to ignore him. I see. It must be a human thing. I don't have a lot of experience dealing with your species, Commander. But I am grateful to you. You saved my life back there, and not just from the volcano. Those Geth would have killed me or dragged me off to Saren. Very true. What did Saren want with you? Do you know something about Why is one of Ashley's hands just in the somehow <laughs> connected to the Prothean extinction? Same with, that is my real same with Garrus. Put your fucking hand in your lap. I've years trying to figure out what happened to them. How old are you exactly? 
I hate to admit it, but I am only 106. <laughs> Damn. Only. I hope I look that good when I'm your age. A century may seem like a long time to a short-lived species like yours, but among the Asari, I am barely considered more than a child. That is why my Actually, you don't even look that good the at the age you are now. Because of my youth, compared to Liara, tend to please know your role. On what you are never leaving the ship again. Uh, wasting your time. I've got my own theory on why the Protheans disappeared. With all due respect, Commander, I have heard every theory out there. The problem is finding evidence to support them. The Protheans left remarkably little behind. It is almost as if someone did not want the mystery solved. It is like someone came along after the Protheans were gone and cleansed the galaxy of clues. But here is the incredible part. According to my findings, the Protheans were not the first galactic civilization to mysteriously vanish. This cycle began long before them. How do you know this? Where did you come up with this theory? I thought there wasn't any evidence. I have been working on this for 50 years. I have tracked down every scrap and shred of evidence. Eventually, subtle patterns start to emerge. Patterns that hint at the truth. It is difficult to explain to someone else. I cannot point to one specific thing to prove <clears throat> my case. It is more a feeling derived from a half century of dedicated research. Her eyebrows I natural I or does she draw them on? Eventually, I will be able to prove genuine because like they're just so civilizations before the perfectly Protheans. straight this like that. They look like they were drawn on. Over. What cycle? What are you talking about? The galaxy is built on a cycle of extinction. Each time a great civilization rises up, it is suddenly and violently cast down. Only ruins survive. The Protheans rose up from a single world until their empire spanned the entire galaxy. Yet even they climbed to the top on the remains of those who came before. Their greatest achievements, the mass <laughs> relays and the citadel, are based on the technology of those who came before them. And then, like all the other forgotten civilizations throughout galactic history, the Protheans disappeared. Wow. I have dedicated my life to figuring out why. Shut up and I'll tell you. You're not much of an expert, Doctor. The answer's been standing in front of you the whole time. The Protheans were wiped out by a race of machines. The Reapers. I hate being mean, Noliara, because she's... A... <laughs> the... The Reapers? She's so nice. Never heard of. <laughs> How do you know this? What evidence do you have? There was a damaged Prothean beacon on Eden Prime. It burned a vision into my brain. I'm still trying to sort out what it all means. Visions? Yes, that makes sense. The beacons were designed to transmit information directly into the mind of the user. Finding one that still works is extremely rare. No wonder the Geth attacked Eden Prime. The chance to acquire a working beacon, even a badly damaged one, is worth almost any risk. But the beacons were only programmed to interact with Prothean physiology. Whatever information you received would have been confused, unclear. I am amazed you were able to make sense of it at all. A lesser mind would have been utterly destroyed by the process. You must be remarkably strong-willed, Commander. Okay, this isn't helping us find Saren or the Conduit. Of Actually, course, shut your right. fucking mouth. I'm sorry, my scientific curiosity got the better of me. Unfortunately, I do not have any information that could help you find the Conduit or Saren. I don't know why Saren wanted you out of the picture, but I think we'll be a lot better off if we bring you along. Thank you, Commander. Saren might come after me again. I cannot think of anywhere safer than here on your ship. And my knowledge of the Protheans might be useful later on. And her biotics will come in handy when the fighting starts. I'm not being We've already got every other non-human species on board. Might as well add an Asari to the team. Thank you, Commander. I am very grateful. Oh, I am afraid I am feeling a bit lightheaded. When was the last time you ate or slept? Dr. Chakwash. Oh, there it goes her hand back into the fucking chair. Just mental exhaustion, coupled with the shock of discovering the Protheans' <laughs> true fate. I need some time to process all this. Still, it could not hurt to be examined by a medical professional. It will give me the chance to think things over. Are we finished here, Commander? Go see the doctor. The rest of you, dismissed. Mission reports are filed, Commander. You want me to patch you through to the council? No, fuck Don't em. bother. Aye, aye, sir. All right, we leveled up. Let's see. Uh, what 
was I trying to get throw so I can get lift? Lift will help me. Because if you lift them into the air, they can't do anything. I think singularity is also really good too. <clears throat> okay, I think that's actually going to do it for me today. Because my throat has been acting pretty fucking annoying today, not going to lie. I've had to mute to clear my throat a couple times now. Well, I'm going to fucking uh, rest for the rest of the day. And hopefully tomorrow we will be able to play a bit longer. Because I do want to play more. I'm having fun. This is fun. I like this game a lot. But, um... Mm -mm. I will be back tomorrow with more Mass Effect, a legendary edition. Uh, I don't think I have anything else to say. Anything else? Follow me on Twitter. No, I'm going live and all that stuff, of course. But um, I will be back tomorrow, 10 a.m. EDT, as per usual. And we'll see you next time. Bye-bye.